my uh what's dark balloon stone Tuna. broken how yes, does fuck you pronounce it yes Not your broken. floating stone is broken okay Tuna. okay yeah. no don't try it. <laughs> yeah, no. Also, I'm let's start it. with the hello, Tom. Hello, Tom. Spam. Ah. Oh, hello, Tom. Ah. Oh, 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 oh. Mwah, I love you. <laughs> Ew. I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know how to spell your name, therefore I can't pronounce it. Good. Like, the time you did, so, the time you did it, it was too loud. Last time you guys uh, fought against a very large monster, a creature that killed Corvus uh, in one blow. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. After the combat, however, and sustaining quite a quite a bit of punches and damage from the guy after throwing an altar as well, Lidith, the druid, she reincarnated Corvus, and he came back as an elf. Yeah. <laughs> so he's still really wearing his old tethered Fucking clothing elves, and stuff, man. so he's not like naked like uh, Mr. Aquaman the other day. <laughs> was this was this picture like, John? Hmm? What What's this picture like? Which picture? Delf. Uh, what picture did he, did he use? Hey Brian, I have, yes. I have a question. Did he uh, come oh, back? Oh, it's really gay. It's really gay. Did he come back <laughs> gay? Sorry? Did he come back gay? <laughs> um, well, he was. He is still in that flamboyant ass shirt. Uh, he is still wearing that flamboyant shirt, yeah. It's uh, old yeah, tattered. Yeah, the flamboyant uh, ass shirt. It's it's not really uh, much to its purpose of what it was, but... Yeah. Oh, no, I, I just asked because, you know, like, all elves are kind of gay, so... Uh, it's not even true, though. Boss, make a balance check. <laughs> no, what? I'm not even walking! You fuck! Uh, make a balance check. <laughs> God damn it! Aww. You almost slip on your beard. Okay, can I can I cut it off with my axe? You can try. Roll for it. Oh. I'm really a tack roll versus your beard. No, just a dexterity. Make a dexterity roll. Why would you dexterity roll? To, to, to pick up his beard and there's just slice it with his axe. Yeah. You're just Carefully. fucking now, aren't you? Just, just, just take a you 20, man. Be short, uh, just below the chin. Uh, but you do cut through it. Also, um, your beard takes fire damage, I believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> yes, it does take fire damage, actually. You can just ask me for a knife, I guess. Uh, your your beard burns up in uh, in, in a way that, that now ha makes you have, like, mutton chops. Oh, uh, I'm fine with that, actually. You take uh, three face damage, or fire damage to the face. Three face damage. <laughs> Sorry, three fire yeah, damage. Are you gonna give me damage for this? Oh, I'm fucking God. kidding you. Jesus fucking hey. All right. Yeah, fine. I'll take. You could use another thing to cut your beard with. But... Yeah, we're, we're spinning off. Use this. Uh, and also, um, I'm fatigued now. Yes, you are. Because, because I use rage. rage. Oh, you're uh, you're fatigued until the end of combat. It is the end of combat. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you're okay. Fatigued. Until the end of combat. Yeah, yeah, not afterwards. Well, I, I guess I have a couple of seconds left, but for the sake of conversation, let's just say that I'm fatigued. Oh, yeah. Also, what, what are we going to do with Wolfram? He's still unconscious. What? Well, away yeah. We've, we've just said that, yeah. Yeah, Wolfram is still unconscious. Yeah. Well, am, am I or am I not? Alright, David, I, mean, I yeah, want no. you to not talk at all anymore, please. David, go. <laughs> Thank you. So, Corvus came back to life, and now an elf. Handsome one of that. Mm. I think I shouldered the cost for that one because I didn't uh, join the combat. I have a question. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Were any of these people uh, wizards? What do you mean? The ones that are dead? Yeah. <clears throat> Sorry. Uh, you can't really tell from where you're standing, at least. Let me rephrase. Do any of them have spellbooks? On their own. <laughs> you don't see uh, a spellbook just laying around now. You can search them. I will attempt to search them. Uh, what is my search? Probably not very high. Uh, the, you, you'll have to get the guy out of the the water first if you want to search him, of course. 
And I believe there's also one underneath the creature. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'll first try to get him out. Yeah. Uh, Alright. The creature weighs a ton, though, but you can roll him over after with some effort. Pushing I mean, into the blubber. Uh, he's quite strong. Some, I can uh, push drag 1,150 feet. I know. You, you can do it. It takes some alleys. effort, but uh, you can you can reach the guy after a while. Or okay. if you hold it up, someone else could search it. Hey, Brian. Brian. I, I just roll him over one square. Brian. Okay. Mm-hmm. Is this Corvus? Yes. Yeah. Uh, uh, you, need to put, you need to make his name and uh, health bar visible. I noticed. Hey. <laughs> hey, Corvus is anime as fuck. Yeah, it looks yeah. like he's just been fucked in the ass. Right? <laughs> yeah, I couldn't find any picture uh, that didn't look bro, like could you, the uh, elf from getting uh, fucked in the ass. over about five feet. Get away from me. Okay, that worked out. I'm not sure where it is. Uh, I think I accidentally deleted it along with the elder. Elder. Oh, oops. Anyway, there's a there's a thing, right? Okay, yeah, sure. Let's just roll it. Corpse. I don't find shit on that one. Uh, it. you just find the plain cultist uh, ropes with not much but a broken body inside. Yeah, hey. Fair enough. I could have... <laughs> Looks like what happened after we left the last cultists. Hey, uh, Maynard, can you yeah. give me one of the ropes, please? Yeah, sure. Uh, I okay. The short bow is snapped in half, Corvus. Yeah, I'm just picking it up because I have sentimental value. Alright. Uh, roll for the corpse up, up there. Oh, shit. I actually rolled well on that one. Uh, you uh, actually do find a spellbook on this guy. Oh, sweet. Um, as well as a, a scroll. Oh, also sweet. And just, uh, th that's it, actually. This one, let's you find on this one. Okay, I can deal with that. Spellbook and a scroll. Yeah, man. I, I'm, I'm, I'm very sorry, but... One elf in the party wasn't right. I kind of stuck with it. <laughs> now we have two. Isn't wait? Isn't all from like half an elf? Uh, how how exactly would I get this guy out of the water? Is this like just a odd little trench that's there, or? Uh yeah, there's like a five foot step to get onto that uh, edge. Yeah. Uh, you, can, you can just stand on there, pretty much. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh, you, could, uh, you could reach in and get him, or you could jump into the water. Article. How deep is the water? Uh, the water is also about five. I feet of water. That guy would have floated away by now. It's a, It seems to be stuck on something. He oh, has okay. a very heavy body. He's wearing armor. <laughs> <laughs> well, then I just grab him by the foot and, like, toss him over there. By the way, Senna. I'm just trying to check, because he does seem to be stuck on something. Okay. Senna, if you find yeah. a monocle, I highly recommend it to put it on right away. If I found any I piece of armor, can I have it? I don't think I have yeah. any cursed items, do I? You rip this guy further in half as it uh, seemed to have been uh, uh, stuck to a metal bar sticking out of some the garbage in uh, in the water. Can I can I roll for a spot to see what kind of armor he's wearing? Yes. <laughs> but you manage. Okay. <laughs> so I ripped him in half by the crotch. <laughs> Pretty much. Okay, that's a little bit morbid. Uh, I'll just be like, uh, whoops. And search his body anyway. Uh, or if anybody else wants to search these guys, you probably should, because I don't search very well. Okay. Brian. I help yeah. him search. Um, I'm kind of done with this. Can I go upstairs? Okay, yes. Corvus finds more than I do. Uh, you know <laughs> that the, yeah, the closest one is right there. Yeah, that was... Uh... You uh, yeah. notice that the sewer grate is locked, though. Is it locked from the inside? Yeah. Okay, then I know where we are. <laughs> well, can I, um... Can I open it? Well, if you have the key, who has the key? Can I just, like, try to fucking brutal... I believe Corvus would have the key if he picked up all his crap. Uh, Alright, never mind. I'll, I'll go back one. to the rest of the fuckers. Uh, also, I rolled I, a 14, Corvus rolled a 22 on the stage. Yeah, I noticed. Also, uh, you, know, you, guys, you guys find a bunch of uh, unopened potions on this guy. Oh. Uh, three, to be precise. Are they labeled? Uh, and and um, some documents, it looks like, but uh, they've been heavily damaged and soaked by water and intelligible, unintelligible. There are yeah. yawns and leans against the um, wall. Actually, I, I would know, men. 
Hold on, I'm typing out. I have men prepared, I think. Hey, um, by the way, Brian. Yes. I give, no, I don't. Uh, Never mind. I give Wolfram still a potion of mediocre healing. Well, I got zero spells and things, okay. so... Nice. That's nice. Brian. Uh, I'll get rid of Protect uh, Poison for right now. Wolfram. <laughs> You're looking uh, terrible. Wolfram, you got a potion of cure moderate wounds. How also, many other wounds? Uh, moderate wounds goes up to plus ten, apparently. Yes, but these are plus fives. Yeah. Like, I, I didn't know that, so I've been rolling wrong on my... Uh, 2 8 plus one. Uh, anyway, I, uh, use my one, I suppose, prepared cast of Mending on that. 2 d plus Okay, I'm a wizard now! Hey. That's amazing! Welcome uh, to the uh, See, um, a light envelop the documents, uh, as you prepare to spell, or cast a spell upon it. And, well, that means you, you uh, get so familiar. And very soon you'll have this pristine set of documents in your hand. Nice. Feels good to be a mage, man. It's like a, it's like a, a folder. You like have to open before you can read. So. Yeah, well, I, I do that then. Okay. Well, you have uh, to you... open it before you can read it. <laughs> you uh, you open it up, and the first page that you see um, appears to be a schematic of sorts, and uh, it, you you very soon realize that it's the the altar that they've built here. Okay. It's on the first page. They're very pragmatic if they needed a schematic to build an altar. <laughs> Can you Surely you just take a bunch of rocks on each other and then smooth them out and make them look pretty. The I... second page okay. has um, it's not a normal altar. It's written a ritual on it. Okay. And uh, well, you, you can probably deduce what for. Oh probably shit, that's right, we're trying to stop cultists. Spot. And the third page, and the last one, um, is, um, is sort of um, what, what looks to be like a, a hastily written report of something. Um, the, the handwriting is really bad, and you have some trouble deciphering it. However, uh, if you sit down, you can probably uh, take your time for it. Okay. Well, hey, man. Mayor, can I have a can I have a look at the document? You can't even read. I yeah. know. <laughs> yeah, sure, go for it. Let's see what you can decipher from it. Oh, wise bearded yeah, yeah. mage of the axe. It Why looks like pictures. Thank you for that astute uh, observation. Yeah, you're very welcome. Lead it. <laughs> you see something uh, shining. Just past this grate, above this corpse. Oh, who's Johnny? It's the monocle. Can I put it on? <laughs> when you get closer uh, to where you saw the, the shininess, you see a key stuck in a little bit of dirt. Oh, never mind. I don't want keys. Oh, hey, does anybody have that fucking uh, extra paper? Uh, I have the paper. I would. Oh, the, the key. Uh, key. Hey, no, um, by the way, this is the question to the party. Yes. Weren't we looking for a serial killer? Yeah, no, no. We, we found them. We were, yeah, we did. The big monster thing was a serial killer. We also found well, the, no, the crazy guy. The cultists guy. were the serial killer, probably, that summoned the giant beast that probably couldn't I get out. Oh, that's why they were collecting body parts, because that's probably. fucking crazy. Yeah. Um, Actually, can I look at the ritual and verify that? Sure. I do that. Yeah. Uh, you... Make a roll for it. Make a knowledge arcana. Uh, I can do that. Uh, what is my knowledge arcana? Uh, hold on. Hold on. Star. Yeah. Is it possible for you to mend my, uh, hover stack? I do not have mend, and mend would not like bring it back to functioning order. Why did it rip? Luckily, so I can have yeah. has nothing to do with collecting body parts. Oh, also, um, Brian, can I help Ellie fix her bow? I, I asked Dara to double check what I just found. Because you can I try, but <coughs> you huh? doubt you can uh, 
make any progress while you're just here in the sewers without proper tools and you know time. Make a knowledge yeah. arcana, Dar. I'm asking you. I'm, to I'm, I'm about to. I'm about to. I'm just checking what my knowledge arcana is again. Probably eight or nine. Uh, no, uh, thirteen. Oh. Yeah. Well, shit. If you roll the same as I did, I don't think you can fail. I know everything about this book now. Well, you know everything <laughs> about the ritual, at the very least. Right. Uh, uh, you know, lay, the, lay that sick knowledge on me. Uh, the ritual uh, takes about a week to perform. Mm -hmm. oh, shit. And uh, you also know that these guys that are dead here, the cultists, uh, actually, they, actually, they, they haven't, been dead, they haven't been dead long, so... Bro, this would be a spellcraft, wouldn't it? Um, not really. No, because it's like how the thing works. If it's stuff how it works, that's spellcraft. Eh, alright, sure. Make, make a spellcraft. My spell, no, my spellcraft is also 13, so it works either way. <clears throat> fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, 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 just, I'm just for a future reference, if we need to look right, okay. for any of those things. <laughs> that's fine. Either yeah. way, you, um, you know that this creature probably hasn't been summoned long ago. Uh, which doesn't coincide with when the murders <coughs> up top were committed. Okay. Um, I say there is a discrepancy. This this thing was only summoned very recently. The murder and the murders have been going on for a while, so there's still more to this. No, I uh, thank you very much. Dun, dun, that was exactly what I'm thinking. Uh, yeah, you have to. You have yeah. the key. It's pretty easy to reach. Uh, Wolfram, uh, make a sort of check on the altar, spin, please. Yeah, I spin the book on my arm, like, uh, on my finger. I was like, mind if I keep this for my uh, personal library? Go for it. You could read it better than I could anyway. So, cheers. Yeah, same put here. It in my, I put it in my personal library inside my like handy haversack. Where is it, bro? <clears throat> Sorry. I'm having a bit of cold, by the way, so I might cough occasionally. Also, the, with the book, is it just for this one specific ritual, or are there other rituals in it? Uh, no, just this one. <clears throat> ah, that's a, that's a bit annoying. Oh. Why did they make a book for it? They could just put it on, like, a single piece of parchment. Terrible. Well, terrible too. maybe. Depends yeah, just, like, how, make uh, a really long scroll. Bro, so roll, it's a week-long ritual, like, so maybe man. there were some rather convoluted steps that they wanted to make sure they had, right? Which well, they apparently I, didn't. Yeah, either I'm gonna turn it into the Mages College. Well, I'm gonna read it. For, I'm gonna read it first, turn it in, and ask for it to have it back because I want to. <laughs> wait, wait, wait on that. Wait on. I said that. you already rolled. Oh, if we I, wait until tomorrow, I, I can just make a copy of that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Because there is a level zero cantrip in Spell Compendium that just lets me copy non-magical text. Can I help him search, bro? Oh, no, but it is my... Okay, yes. yeah, I guess it is mundane text, isn't and By it? the way, like, it is. Yeah. yeah. Right. Can you give me... Uh, by the way. If you help him search, you just give him a plus two on his roll. Ah. Uh, I uh, healed. Uh, but go I ahead. I the bro. altar. You search the altar as well, okay? You just yeah, search probably. alongside it, but... No. Yeah. Okay. Uh, all right, Wolfram, you make the rules well. No, no, I'm, um... Search. All right. I know it uh, Wolfram, you, uh, you don't find anything particularly interesting uh, on the altar. However, Corvus, you find uh, a little button on the, underneath the altar that seemed to have survived the impact. A little button. <laughs> oh, shit. All right. Um. Yeah. Um. Let it roll for it. Do you press the button? Thank no, you I very don't. much. Okay. Like, we're probably gonna sleep at some point. You're uh, awfully cool with just being resurrected into an elf. Oh, oh, fabulous. Uh, um, Brian. <laughs> fabulous. Yes. Brian. Brian. Yes, yes. I'm walk over here and can I slap Corpus because he's an elf now? Can I, I dodge? Out. Roll reflex. Just uh, roll an attack roll, I guess. Yeah, on our reflex, please. Well, oh, I'm not gonna use no armor I have well, no armor, so I would literally get hit. 
Uh, is that a D4? Oh yeah, is he naked? No, yeah, he's been reincarnated into the body. D4. Uh, no, because he had. Uh, you know it's what? a D4 I... non-lethal damage. I... Yeah, 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 yeah. Of course, of course. The reason why his name was naked is because he was naked to start with. It's, uh, a, uh, it's a gentle, it's a gentle, uh, like a pretty weak slap, to, slap. Chin, or to the to the two cheeks. Sorry. No. Can I slap him as well? Yes. Of course. Uh, do I have to roll um, strength check tackle? or a dex check? No, well, just a tackle. Can I have a slapping contest here in the sewers? It's fun. Okay. I start before I use whole person on both of you, but I'll stop that shit. Holy shit! Oh, what the Whoa. fuck did you crit me? Did you crit slap me, you bitch? <laughs> is that a crit? Is that a crit? You crit slap me. Crit? Right, that's yeah. a crit slap. Uh, no, no, no. It, it's not a crit. Sorry, I have uh, my crit. Just a d4. Uh, uh, just a normal d4. Just it. It's a very well aimed though. Well, this is <laughs> happening. Maynard walks over and sees it. You see two guys re weakly slapping each other. It, it's such there, a hissy fit. It. It's just a hissy fit. Like, eh, I don't oh, like yeah, you, you mean the thing about doubling the multiple? Yes, everything multiple. except the extra dice. Yeah, everything but precision damage and extra dice. Thing. <laughs> no, I'm just like, this is pathetic. Yeah, yeah well, it is. <laughs> Does the dead body dead bodies have any armor on them, like a shitty leather armor or something? Uh, yes. Make a search check on uh, on one of them. <laughs> Wait, are you naked? I rolled a twenty-two, twenty. Yeah, uh, I think he did are actually roll a twenty-two earlier. All right, fair enough. Yeah. Uh, I guess we can easily uh, watch that back later, so you be good. But that's fine. Um, if you uh, roll a twenty-two, you Ooh. see that this guy uh, actually right here, where you're standing next to, that you just dragged out of the uh, the water. He has pretty finely made uh, what looks to be studded leather armor. And if you look closer, you see that the armor is uh, shaped or uh, decorated <coughs> with all sorts of kind of uh, patterns and designs. For example, his shoulders are mostly uh, made to look like scales of some creature, it looks like. Uh, on his back, there are a bunch of feathers engraved into, uh, the, uh, into the back area. And... Um, Okay. Yeah, you can take it. Uh, you can take it off. Of course. And you wear it. And I took it. Yeah. <coughs> okay. I wear it. I don't sure. have any armor on me. Should uh, they let me check it to make sure it's not cursed or something? Yeah, sure. that's fine. All right. Uh, I got it. I don't know if I will take too long as well. Take the. Do you cast attack magic or something? It it's just normal spell. Hey, it's just normal spellcraft. If it's um, oh, so... Lilith cast a detected magic, uh, oh. and there is definitely magic aura coming from this uh, leather armor. Okay. Uh, you're not, you're, well, you're not have to give me a second because I, I popped into the kitchen to make a cup of tea. Okay. Uh, I give Wolfram my bag and ask him. I did ask him to help me carry it. I think. I think. Well, uh, okay. Right. Ask him to help me carry it again. You know yeah. what? Uh, I'll I'll go back to the grave and just try to slam it open because I just well you know what maybe I'm not as comfortable as you are with being in the sewer. Yeah, sure. Uh, you guys hear uh, Buzz banging on uh, the sewer exit there. Uh, Corvus, Dara, don't want you have the key. Um, didn't they pick up the key from just around the corner? Or are all the keys the same? We just picked up a key, uh, Leah. Yeah. If you want, you can examine the key. Yeah. Identify materials. Okay, so identify materials created or shaped by magic, such as. Oh, no, wait. Give me a second. Magic. Oh, uh, in character, I tell Dara that uh, there's also a note near the back of that uh, oh. file of crap that he should probably read, but it'll take him a bit because it's so badly written. All right, I'll sort that out. Just, uh... I wanted a piece of paper, right, Maynard? What? You wanted a piece of paper? I could use some paper. I gave you all the paper the dude gave me. No, you need a shit, right? Okay. 
Honestly, I could probably just go buy some. <laughs> but so, Ro, was it that um, you can use spellcraft to identify magic items, or just use the identify spell? Uh, you have to use the identify spell to identify the properties of an item. What I'm saying is, when the, is there another way to do it without using the spell? No. You don't think so? That seems a bit. <laughs> well, there is the. Uh, <laughs> try no, there's trial and error, like looking to yeah, see. Yeah. What that's what I was gonna say. Yeah. Uh, Lena, when you look closer at the key you just picked up, you see that it's apparently it's spellcraft. Yeah. Very similar to the to the great you guys have been passing or breaking into, or through. Yeah. Okay, Ro. It's twenty plus the level of the spell that was used to create the item. For that's the DC for identifying the item. Thirteen. So. <laughs> Yeah, so if it's a fifth level spell or lower that we used to create it, so you can tell me what it is. You can find the if the item has a spell description, or you can just make up whatever spell level you think would be made for the thing. I don't really know; it's your call. It doesn't. No, it doesn't really say that you can uh, see what the stuff is on uh, the thing with. Shaped Opera. by magic. That was yeah. made or shaped by magic. I would think that would. That's materials created or shaped by magic, but the materials aren't created or shaped by magic. Yeah, it's the so. properties of uh, the, the the weapons or the item or the armor that is the magical Fair. thing. You think so? Right. Okay. That's the only one who actually wants to get out of the sewers. Uh yeah, you see a lock there, uh, Lilith, and the the key fits. So it's... identify it later. Well, I don't have to sit in the sewers for like an hour. <laughs> Sorry, Buzz I'm earlier you... looking through spell compendium. Buzz, earlier you said you got a theme fuels, right? What? Buzz, yeah. Theme fuels. You have one, right? You got an extra set of thief tools, right, Buzz? Uh, yeah, I do actually. Yeah, sorry. I asked Kim if I could borrow it for a while because mine broke. <laughs> borrow it? No, son, <laughs> son, son. That ain't how it works, mate. You uh, can buy them off me. You guys found three how potions much? and a spell book and a scroll. You know what? I'll sell it to you for uh, one hundred gold. One orange gold, sure. One orange gold? What's this about? Oh, yeah, one orange, orange gold. gold. No gold. <laughs> I'll give him a silver and I'll tell him it's uh, orange gold that was dyed silver. Alright. <laughs> in that bluff. case, let's hit him in the face and tell him to fuck off. I'll roll a bluff. Let's see if you believe it. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do that. <laughs> That's actually quite funny. <laughs> Manishina, what are you trying to say? Bluff me! Well, I mean, he has to roll a sense motive against that. Yeah, so. You have to roll on the post sense motive. Yeah, but against a fucking thirty. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you can believe him. Yeah, you, you believe him. Uh, let's do this. Let's roll the play. Yeah, on that side, there's also a lock uh, with a keyhole, Manishina. Uh, you don't, you don't really have to like you know roll for that. You can just see it hanging there. You know, I, I give him the thief tools, mm -hmm. but you better know this, mate. When I find out, <laughs> <It's not. laughs> uh, God. these are all fucking idiots. I love it. All right. But yeah, you have a, a new set of thief tools now. Thank you. Uh, there you go. Mate. You fucking asshole. Uh, you think back, man, Stina, and you realize that on every grade so far, there's been a keyhole. Oh, oh we're not done yet. Uh, the key fits this keyhole as well. Fantastic. <coughs> Amazing. <laughs> It looks like you're in the possession of a skeleton key that opens up all the graves in the sewers. 
Oh, let Mario. Oh, shit. Or Master Key, yes. <clears throat> I read the. Uh... Oh, crap, I forgot his name. Oh, this is where the party turns. Uh... Oh, my God. Psychopathic. I mean, to be fair, there's, there's been something wrong with us since we fucking started. So. That's true. <laughs> It's not, it's not really that much of a step. Buzz almost killed a citizen in the first session. Yeah, well, he kind of. Timothy is probably going to pay for I know, a lot of I mean, The guy had been thing. fucking kidnapped and captured and locked in a cage, and the first thing you do when you break him out is threaten him with death. <laughs> oh, yeah. That sounds like Buzz. That, yeah. That's kind of what you do, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, that was right before they uh, saved you, man. All right, so the grave's Fair open. Enough. I'm glad I was able to break out of my own cage then. Yes. <laughs> Lily, uh, do you tell the other um, party members? That's important. Yes. I love how you struggle to find a word for us as well. <laughs> the other... Um, the, uh, the other... Uh, um, friends? No. Uh, yeah. Mm. yeah, well, I... I had Fucking to... idiots, yeah. That's the word oh, I'm looking no, for. I, I was considering assholes, but then again... <laughs> You know, well, so what do you guys I, do next, guys? Well, yeah, I, I, um, I want to know if uh, Lily tells the rest of the party because I, I'm uh, totally not aware of what's happening. Well, the serial killer is still at large. I've, I've determined that. Uh, is the the serial grates open, right? What time of night is it? You did twice. All right, then I'll come uh, across over there. Hello. It uh, is uh, it, it's still locked. Actually, it hasn't been opened yet. Really? Oh, it didn't open. <laughs> Well, somebody get over here and I... fucking unlock it. No, oh, fuck it, I'll do it. Can, after, I, do, can I, I just do a somebody get over here with a key or the rogue do his job? I don't care which. Can Sorry, I just? I didn't know you. Uh... No, no, no. I mean, did you unlock the grades to the? Like, no, not yet. Button? No, not yet. Yeah. Uh... Oh yeah, both grades are unlocked. All right. Can I do a spot check? See what. Uh, we're there in that area. Uh, just a very long, broad tunnel, much like this. I, it's a grate. You can't see through it. Yeah, you can. It's it's a grate, but it's only in the barest sense, sense of the term. It's not like a manhole well, ever. Well, like, I'm, I don't want to be an asshole, but I'm going to be, sorry. Um, if you see this sound grate, what do you think you will see? Or will end up with. I'll be honest. I this over here annoys me. That seems like it was put there on purpose, as like something different. <laughs> like it sticks out just as much as the fucking trap right next to it does. Bro is well, chuckling. Bro is chuckling, guys. I think we found something. <laughs> well, if you I want to he... the party, we can go and investigate. No, I just really like his way of thinking. Uh -huh. Anyway, I, you can just assume I said that to the party as is. Like, why would I? Oh, yeah, yeah, I don't know. Just pointed the map. This right here. I don't know. Yeah. I don't like. I don't like it. It seems weird. I couldn't punch oh, it hard shit. enough. I don't like anything. I can't punch hard enough. Uh, when you look at the map though that you guys got from uh, Bill, what? Uh, you do see that like the legend for this map is pretty much in that space where there's nothing supposedly. Yeah, exactly. Of shit. Nothing. Ex Explicit, but... Does that open the, uh, great thingy, bro, 15? Uh, if lead it opens the grate over there, then it doesn't open the no, grate. No, I mean, the... like, over Top. here. Yeah, no, she hasn't done that yet. Toast. She hasn't been there. I rolled up. I rolled hey, a 11. Hey, guys, no, here's, no, 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 here's sorry. just an idea, right? Well, we did this for some person. Why don't we exit the fucking sewers? by the best entrance possible and which are in my opinion is here and then just go to the person that gave us the quest just an idea I'm just throwing it out there what do you guys think I do not have the ability to duplicate that key I am sorry <laughs> I guess that... Need, that neither to, do I, my third level spells are go faster and go slower. 
I don't have third level spells. So. I have third level spells, but mine are shit. <laughs> Speed up and slow down. Those are mine. Uh, and make the other person like re-roll. Well, that mm. that's insanely good. Yeah, but yeah, I have, it costs me um, 100 experience every time I use it. That's insanely shitty. It's a swift action though, so I don't even have to use a standard action to do it. It's like, if there's like a critical blow or something, oh, I just say, nope, you have to reroll that. I'll turn this out. Okay. <laughs> oh, sweet. Does that do it? That does it, Corvus, yes. Unlock uh, the grade to the top that was level. The most condescending shit I've ever heard. <laughs> yes, it's open! <laughs> yep, alright, let's go back upside. You guys all go up to, uh, go upside then? Yeah, we go upside. I'm leaving the sewers right now, Julian. <laughs> you finished the dick hole. <laughs> Alright. Get you guys back on the city map. You, you grab the armor piece, right? Uh, yeah, you grabbed the armor, yes. You, no I one's am. wearing it, I think, yet, I though? Yeah, I no am. one's wearing it. Can you uh, ping on the map while we're actually leaving the sewers? Yes, of course. I was gonna do that. Uh, thank you. You're a champion. <coughs> I'm amazing! <coughs> Sorry. Can you keep on fighting to me? Um, let's see. You guys came out the sewers... ...right around... Here, ah, uh, the shit bar I found. God damn it! <laughs> it is uh, still the shit bar. Is it the elf? Bar? Is it the elf bar, or is it literally yeah, just the shit bar? The elf bar, yeah. It no, is. this is like the the south end district where yeah, uh, where people elf mostly elf. live, and uh, you know where how Sanguine has its headquarters. Yep. Bro, can I visit the uh, uh, magic lady or the kid? Did we ever uh, ask what's his face if he was stealing body parts from people after he killed them? It's um it, it's around six ish. The sun is uh, setting. Uh, most of the shops will be closed by now. You know that much, and it'll probably uh, be uh, an hour or two later before you actually reach the shops. I do it tomorrow then. Hey guys, shall we just um, get um, back to the uh, get it over days. with and find something? Or somewhere to sleep. First, the inn, the brothel in place. We should because... probably visit Timothy Greenstone first. I take the armor of Corvus. So I'll tell him I'll identify it the bed. Okay. Yeah, but um, I'm being serious here. Um, shall we just go to sleep somewhere? Yeah, we're gonna Sorry. go over here to where we're actually staying. Probably take a shower and get the shit smell off of us. And then go about tomorrow doing what we need to do. Exactly. Yeah. Thank you very much. Um, all right. Promise, man. Does everybody what agree? Yes. All right. Is Give you guys a little token on the map where you guys are now. Hey, right, uh, you guys had to. Um, that was to a patented idea, bro. I don't like you stealing it. <laughs> <laughs> your panties bro. are in your bag. Yeah, you only got one. You didn't. Panties. Well, if you want, you could have taken their panties, but yeah. <laughs> All right, um, I'll run the room and just go to bed, I guess. Like this isn't just ogre panties anymore. This is Buzz. Strange. Where do you uh, Where do you want to rent the room, though? Do you want to go to back to the brothel? Uh, you know what? Yeah, I'm going know. back to the brothel. I'm going where the where the rest of the party is uh, staying. Okay. Uh, I'm staying the in the hostel in the nicer part of town. Yeah. yeah. So no one's going actually to House Sanguine right now. Oh, yeah, actually, that's true. I need to. I'll, I'll go. I'll go make the report. Uh, if you're um, gonna do that, you take this paper. I'll just go buy some. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'll well, you guys look at each other and smell each other and realize you guys are. Healthy. Yeah. Yeah. I'm mean, gonna jump in the river. 
I, I mean, he knows all the how Sanguine guy knows what he sent us to do, so it's better to look punctual. <laughs> Hey, and sure, also, Dara can still act dignified while smelling like shit, it's fine. Okay. He's, he's a professional. Uh, uh, you make, yeah, uh, who who uh, else goes to House Sanguine? I yeah, I'm going there as well. Wolverine uh, and Buzz? Hmm? Wolverine and Buzz go with you? And mm -hmm. Manistine as well? Cool. I follow him as well. Oh Let's god. See what oh, this is a bad Here idea. Is. Just okay. <laughs> you know what? As well. Just, just, just everyone me, goes I... to House Sanguine. That I, I, oh. I was actually gonna go back to the uh, Pleasure Treasury so I can That's read that fine, stolen you spell book. Then you're not. There. I follow Maynard. Oh Jesus Christ, Corbus, make it your mind. Yeah, I follow Maynard now. Nah, fuck it. All right, I'm, cool. I'm uh, we'll go to you guys I'm later. First, go to people uh, arriving at House Sanguine. Um, the doors are closed, but there is a light shining through it. All right, I'll, I'll um, knock hard on the doors. All right, uh, after a short while, uh, it's opened yeah. by uh, the secretary that what it um, egg. the green you guys before. By the lovely smell and she goes, um, I'm terribly sorry, but uh, uh, Mr. Green Tom is not seeing anyone right now. Um, you you can come back tomorrow morning before the council meeting. Nah, fuck that shit. I'll push her out of the way. Oh god. <laughs> Glad I'm not there. Just an attack roll? This, this... No, just a no, strength, strength check. Strength check. Strength check, alright. Okay, seriously, holy crap, Buzz. First thing uh, you do I... after getting out of the sewer is accost somebody while smelling like poo. Alright, oh, you, uh, you push her out of the way and she falls over. Ah! <laughs> right. Fuck her. Please, sir. I, I apologize. Mr. isn't even here right now. What? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not there. I'm not the party face right now. Dara, it's up to you to wrangle him in. Right, I whistle. Well, I don't even, I don't pick her up because I, I put I take a handkerchief out of my bag, put it over my hand because my hands smell like shit, and then I like raise her up, like whistle, pick her up. She just like sorry. shaking like a leaf as she uh, gets picked up. Yeah. She goes, please. She, he's not even here, and honestly, I I, I doubt he'd want to see you uh, like this. No, <laughs> it's, it's fine. It's uh, forgive our friend. He's a barbarian. You know how they are. Yeah, I, whatever. Do you ooh, have a barbarian, you say? Ball. And she she seems to have forgotten all about it. She's like looking at him now, kind of like, ooh, barbarian. Oh, oh, she was the dean. Oh. <laughs> anyway, right, we'll come back in the morning. Thank you for your yes, time. Please. Uh, oh my! I guess it was just a misunderstanding. Hey, <laughs> and uh, <coughs> fuck it. I'm sorry for capping. I, uh, I asked if I can have a bath here anyway. A what? A bath. A bath. A bath. A bath. No, uh, there aren't. It's an office. There's, it's an there's office no building. bath in, in in this place. I'm afraid. Yeah, where can we go? Right next to a river, though. You could go jump in that if you want to. Yeah, fuck that. Yeah, I want a one mean, bath. Every inn would have a bath, I think. Yeah, but you don't like have a one pleasure here. treasury. One Shut might up. say. I'm no, sorry. there's nothing in in this headquarters. No, this is like an office building. It doesn't have a bath. It has a toilet, but. <laughs> well, can I, really I like an out. Can I can I take a shit down? Oh, <laughs> yes. All right, yeah, thank you. We're right back in there. Uh, she goes like uh, it's it's over there down the hall to the right. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Okay. Oh, right. take a do you uh, do you guys do anything else there, or do you guys go to the place? Uh, well, I mean, I, I have no reason to go back to the pleasure treasury, so I split ways with them and go back to my hotel. Oh, yeah, she got your own uh, place, not too far yeah. from them. Yeah. Uh, it's fine. Uh, we'll go to the rest of the. Place. You know what, I'm not doing anything interesting. I'm just reading. Yeah, I spent the right first night reading poetry and looking through the ritual book to see if I can get I, any I forgot this, but I need to actually go buy a spell book. Yes, you guys are met by uh, Madame Bosom and... Uh, oh, like, oh dear, what happened uh, to you Madame guys? Bosom, Please. Um, ever, when I took my shit, I'll rejoin with the other party. Yep, that's fine. Yeah. Like yeah. Uh, uh, we got the wrong corpus here. <laughs> 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 Mama, do you not recognize me? It's me, your baby boy. <laughs> yeah. 
He has some explaining yeah, to do. A bunch of shit-covered people walking through the tavern, and at first you're all stopped by uh, the bouncer, but soon Madame Bosom sees who you guys are and goes like, Oh, please, what happened to you guys? You guys should clean up. Please, come, come. And she gets Corvus, your own, uh, Corvus? Where's my baby Corvus? Uh, she does go, uh, have, you, have you seen my Corvus, though? I passed. Nah. Oh no, I'm at my uh, place. Never mind. I don't know. Uh, since Darrow's not here, I'll take the lead on this one. I just pull the uh, no newly minted elf forward. <laughs> There's a lot of explaining to do. It's we a boy. This is Corvus. <laughs> Please roll with it for right now. Well, <laughs> no, we that's got, not Corvus. No, we got someone. Uh, um, I just completely identity fraud. Um, what? Identity fraud, he said. You what? He said something about identity fraud. What, what? Were you actually going to say something of worth, or were you just no, replying no, no, to that? That's fine. No, no, no. Don't, don't mind me. And, uh oh, Lilith, for fuck's sake, stop doing that. Anyway, Lilith. uh, Lilith walks in, so I'm like, her magic was what caused this, so I'll let her explain. <laughs> On the bright side, Corvus is not dead. Uh, when a mommy druid and a daddy druid love each other very, very much, they make a little elf body, <laughs> and they put this and they put the soul of your dead son inside it. Oh shit! Long story short, I died. I got reborn into an elf. Can I take a bath now, please? I smell like shit. What? No, please. this is just too. I don't want to smell like shit. I can't believe this. Where is my Corvus? And she looks at you guys. Corvus I, I, I just keep pointing at her. Or at him. Yeah. Nah, like, I, shouldn't you no. be able to roll for it? No. Nah, roll diplomacy or something. No, nah, no, nah, I'll take the, It'll be a bluff. Oh, no, 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 he's not going to. It would be diplomacy, I'd say. Uh, Linus is also trying to just outright explain. Yeah, so maybe uh, yeah she finds it very hard to believe that. She doesn't seem to grasp the concept at all. Like, what do you mean, no. soul back? What happened to his soul? I mean... Magic. He got pummeled into goo. I'm not in the good way. Are you saying Corvus dead? He no. died. He's back. He's, back. he's an elf now, but he's back. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm liking, I'm liking where this is going. She looks a bit closer at you, Corvus, and... Uh... Is it really you? Corvus, yeah. say something only she would know about you. Yeah. Uh, let's see. So I met you because of Look at my dick! Shh, shut up, Tom. <laughs> I met you because of Captain Shannon. Oh, come on. <laughs> you sit your ass in Corvus and say Corvus, uh, speak for a minute? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Dungeon I Master because... confirmed. Shh. Jesus Christ, Tom. I met you because of Master Seamus. I was this lucky. I delivered letters to you for yeah. years. Oh my god, Corfu, what happened to you? You look so, I don't know, kind of handsome, actually. I am fabulous. I am fabulous. <laughs> Can I please have a bath now? I yes. smell like yes, shit. Yes, of course, yes. Please. And she directs all of you guys to uh, rooms with baths. Oh, uh, finally. And she also asks you guys if you want anything to uh, wash you, or anyone, I should say. I'm good. Soap. <laughs> and I don't mean a person called soap. I mean just literal regular soap, please. <laughs> in, in before soap, soap McTavish from Modern Warfare 2 comes out of the corner. <laughs> yes, you get it. Uh, you guys are the right there. Seeing that as well, uh, you, you will also direct it. Towards a room with a bath, if you uh, if you so desire. <laughs> Otherwise, you're not really welcome unless you. I would say. Wait, what? Do we have fresh clothes? Oh dear! If it wasn't for you, I would have lost Corpus forever. So I guess this is better than nothing. Uh, I I just point out, in all due fairness, he is the one who went ahead and got punched in the face by the giant blood beast. Well, he always did have a knack for finding trouble. Fair enough. <laughs> I like how she just glosses that over like I don't even want to know. Giant blood beast, you in the last one? 
Oh, honey, <laughs> you've uh, been in this business for as long as I have. You see the strangest people in the strange, yeah, in yeah, the strange yeah, stories. Yeah, 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 enough talking, lady. Where can I get a shower or a bath? She yeah. has already directed everyone towards yeah. the room. All right, uh, thank you. Fuck off. Wow. He's a bug. conversations that I have with you people are like inside the oh, room. Oh, I see that we're sharing a room. Oh, um, no, we're not. Either way, what the fuck are you talking okay. about? <laughs> are you sure? I mean, uh, you don't have to be just kidding. Comfortable doing that, yeah. I mean, we're not going to roleplay that, but... <laughs> oh, uh, actually, I asked if she has, like, a wash tub for, like, clothes or something like that. Don't, 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 don't. I've been feed. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you guys all take a nice bath. Sorry, maybe? Oh, sorry, I thought my head was just freaking out. No, but my body... <laughs> <laughs> Either way, I ask if she has like a wash tub in one of those things they used to use to clean clothes. Uh, yeah, there's like a washing board. Uh, oh feature. yeah, washboard. Washboard. Yeah. One of those things. I uh, ask if I can use that after. Yes, yes, yeah. you're free to use uh, the item supplied. Okay, thank you. Where should I put, where should we put the shit covered clothing? Well, I don't. I, I guess it's not taking all the washing crap. Maybe you can get Maynard to wash yours for you. Just make a really oh, nice. <laughs> my clothing doesn't really belong to me. Come on, man. Come on, Come on, Jeez, don't give me this shit. Uh, yeah, Lidith, uh, a female elf assistant is sent in. What, you need a fucking assistant to get clean, you fucking mental, man. It's like a bad house. Yeah, I figured that much. Fucking uh, If you guys afterwards just sleep, then uh, you are rested. Yeah. yeah. And you, you, you're yeah. level in uh, points. Uh, right. um, and how does it work again? Your constitution bonus uh, plus four or something? No, it's uh, you're uh, heal your level, 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 I think. Yeah. You, you just heal level. 8 hit points if you're level 8. Oh, that's perfect. Nice. That happens to be just <laughs> enough to get me to max. Nice. And you guys want to wake up? Um, early in the morning. Yeah, yeah early you, need to, you need to put in my new HP value. Um, I need to put in your new HP value? Yeah, because I can't, I can't edit that, I don't think. Also, anybody who had me wash their clothes, you now owe me. Uh, Sorry, what, is your, what, is your, what is your max now? Uh, now? 44. Bro, did you change my max health volume? Ain't nobody watching my clothing. Well, I don't <laughs> want to touch your clothing, I don't know where it's been. Okay. Oh, Bro, you know where it's been, boy. Did you change my maximum health value? How much do you have now? And I don't remember if we changed it or not. Uh, 37 was your last one. How much do you have now? Uh, okay, shit. And also, for the people uh, who had uh, a dexterity disadvantage last game, also yeah, remember that's, uh, that's you can... Let me oh, open the uh, chat. It's one now. God damn it. Uh, it's gone. The, the, the dexterity from the mushrooms. Oh, you're too kind. Anyway. Yeah, well. Um, anyway, sorry, Corvus, what did, uh, what did you roll? Uh, the, uh, it's loading. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay, it's been a while. Yeah. Uh, I guess I... I all, all of you guys. Boys, how much HP do you have now? Uh, 89. No, oh, 99. 99. No, 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 no. I, I, uh, I have one short. Yeah, that's what I said. Oh, I have 99 now. Yeah, yeah, 99 total. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure, whatever. That's what you, you've run short of 100, right? I was run short of 100, but uh, I healed only 8 points and... No, I mean, in total, you are one short of 100. Oh, yeah, yeah, Because you yeah. rolled shitty. Yep. <laughs> I yeah, I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, you tried to okay. cheat. Uh, Wolfram, how much hit points do you have in total right now? Seven three. Oh, you did it yourself. Okay, that's good.
Right, cool. We're all good. Uh, you guys wake up around six or seven ish when uh, the sun is just peeking through the curtains of your uh, respective rooms. Oh. And uh, I don't know who wants to go first in waking up. Yeah, waking up. Yeah, I do. Yeah, right, don't worry about it. I will, because I just meet up with them. Okay, it's still, I want you guys to talk one at a time, because <laughs> I still don't know. So I will, yeah, because I need, um... to meet, I need to meet up with them to begin with, so. Okay, John, I'll start with you. Wake up. What do you want to do? Get dressed. Pet Finley. Put on a hat. Pet okay. Finley in hats. <laughs> Got my bags. Um, use my quarter staff as a walking stick and set out on the road. And I arrive. And I'm just here, and I wait for them by the fountain, you think? Okay. Oh, you're yeah. going to go to the Arcanium probably today, right? Or uh, to uh, House Sanguine for... Oh, uh, no, yeah, I forgot one thing. Like, before before I went to sleep yesterday, I called up my um, my boss. You know, the, uh, the Dean, whatever you call him, the, like, Master Wizard. Yes. Yeah. The Arcanium Arcan Arcan to give him a report on... Uh, the thing he told me to get, give him a report on. It's just that there's no so there's no significant uh, changes. It really doesn't seem like he, he is still a danger, but that's just him. It's nothing from the new items acquired. His beard is still growing though. Okay. Yes. Oh, what the fuck, mate? I'm still <laughs> danger. Uh, You're a danger to everybody, mind. including yourself. But that's just yeah, you we'll naturally. Just, we'll go to you next. What do you, what do you want to do? Me? I go. I go outside. Like. I okay. see Dara. I, before I go outside, I tell everyone that I'm going to go to the, uh, what's the place called again? The one with the lady with the kid? House Sanguine? That's magic. No, the magic no. merchant. Oh, uh, the place. magic shop, yes. Oh shit, yeah. yeah, I'm still asleep, aren't I? Uh, what's it called again? Anyway, I tell everyone- I can't even remember it, I forgot. And my teammates said I'm gonna go there, and I'll be back what? here later, and then I go outside. I'm no fucking okay. home on speed, mate. Oh shit. I tell the bartender then, or one of the people in there that I know, someone to wait there, I guess. Okay. It's fine. And then I see John in the um, fountain thing. Um, Brian, I think this will uh, go um, along well. Because yes, what do you want to do, Buzz? I ordered breakfast. Uh, which of course is um, a slice of pork, scrambled eggs with some bacon and a nice uh, jug of dwarf nail. Okay. And um, then I also want to go to the fucking wizard tower. Okay. You want to go with Dara, uh, I guess? Or I want... no, wait. You just want to go by yourself? Uh, uh, oh, this doesn't matter to me. Like, I just good. Um, without a proper guide, you wouldn't know where to go. Well, um, I'll find a guide then. I mean, no, let's say the Arcanium can somewhat be seen uh, from a distance, but the closer you get, the more buildings obscured. So, at some point, you would need directions to uh, to find it. Yeah, but they're mostly dwarf on that. Oh no, um, you yeah, know they're what, working um, walking around. Yeah, uh, what, what are they called again? <laughs> uh, you can try and no, fix it. I'll scream as you humans. But, uh, yeah, sorry. Uh, it's no. probably better to uh, go to the blacksmith. Anyway, sorry, Buzz? Yes? Sorry, my mouth is full. My, mind. <laughs> <laughs> my HP is 43 now. Ah, <clears throat> my HP is 43. Should I um, roll and gather information? For? Um, Known how to find a place. No, you can just ask the guards along the way. It just takes you oh, some time. Yeah. Well, fair enough, fair enough. It takes okay. you some, uh, a little bit longer than if you would know the, the way yourself or if someone. Yeah, I know it. I got it. Alright. Um, Wolfram, where do you want to go or what do you want to do? Actually, I just realized this. We never checked those cultists for gold. Uh, you guys didn't find any gold pieces on them or any coin whatsoever. Okay, fair enough. All right, I just thought of it. <laughs> I'm so what they had on them that we did. No, I, I imagine if you can find the magic items on them, then you also find the whatever coins they would have. Fair enough. <coughs> oh, boy. 
Uh, you want to find a, a smithy? Uh, you know, it's going to take a few hours to get there. As the, or unless you want to find a smithy in the poor district, and what uh, you would probably have to find one close to the mines, for that matter. Uh, which is a bit to the south. You can find that easily. Okay, uh, you make your way to the mines, Maynard. Uh, I want to go somewhere to get a proper uh, spell book. I for assume myself. the main lady kills it. And a spell, okay. commit, or a spell component pouch. Whether that would be the mage tower or the weird lady with the cursed magic items, I don't really care which. Um, you, what you know of is that you can probably get those. Oh, that reminds me. Um, I want to go back to that shop. <laughs> yeah, you can. Okay, but give it a moment. I'm still doing yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. Go. Do continue. Sorry. So, yeah, I guess I go there, get my spell book and spell component pouch. Okay. Uh, so you travel along with Corvus and Boss then and Manistina? Oh, wait. Yeah. Uh, Yes. On yeah, the man. way there, I uh, cast Read Magic, because mages can prepare that from memory, even if they're a wizard. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I okay. use that to read that scroll I have. Uh, the scroll is um, is pretty interesting. It's got three spells on it. Oh, sweet. Uh, give me a second while I look them up. That's close, that thing. Didn't think you would... Well, actually, I did. You didn't think I would actually try to use Read Magic on it? Yeah, I know you tell me. Um, there is a spell of no direction. No direction. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna have to look up what that does. Endure elements. Okay, that one's neat. I like that. Oh dear. And and as finally, invisibility. Oh, fancy. Uh, am I to assume this is an arcane scroll? Yes. Okay. Otherwise you wouldn't be able to read it. Well, I could read it regardless, I just wouldn't be able to use it. Ah, uh, that's true. Yeah, my bad. It's all good. Okay. okay. Um, do you guys want to try and identify the potions as well that you got? Well, I can't do that with read magic. Uh, you can do that with spellcraft, I believe. Yeah, but I don't have very high spellcraft like Dara does. I don't have the wow. skill points to just chug into that. Well, Dara can do it. Fair enough. Or whatever. I'm still stopped by the pond thing, yeah. Yeah. But what? I'm still. Uh, I'm still. I'm still sat here, so. Yeah, I'm talking to Dara right there. Uh, uh yeah. Oh, hey, that uh, one's a bard spell. I'm also in that vicinity. But um. You want to try and identify them, Dora, or? Huh? I mean, oh, Maynard is right there. Oh yeah, fuck. Um, how much is it for identify? So I think it's a hundred. So no, I mean, what, what was... uh, I mean, you can you can spellcraft potions. Yeah, I know, but what I'm saying, I identified the uh, the armor before I went to bed, didn't I? Oh, okay. Yes. Um. Yes. Okay. Fine. Uh, it is an armor or started leather plus two. All right. Oh shit. And it has the enchantment beast skin on it. Oh. Which, Wait, you know, uh, allows someone that has the wild shape ability to retain that armor uh, and add it to their wild shape armor. Pull him. <gasps> I trade it with Lilith. I guess if she has an armor, I ask her if I can have her armor. Uh, you have two arcane scrolls that you haven't known yet? Hold on. Okay. Just looked at uh, Wolfram in chat. So you want me to roll the spellcraft for those now, then? Uh, no, okay. you already did that. Apparently. Uh, letter plus two, mm -hmm. which works along with your beastcraft. Uh, Wolfram, one of them is a scroll of color spray and cure light wounds. And the other scroll only has one spell on it, and it is Disguise Self. <coughs> yeah, Color Spray. Uh, yes, the enchantment on the armor allows you to keep um, your armor of that piece of armor. 
uh, to your wild shape form mm. at the expense of one extra uh, wild shape per day. Yeah. And I besides... the last time she wild shaped anyway. So if yeah. you want to keep the armor bonus of your studded leather, then you uh, and you wild shape, then you actually use two wild shapes for that day. Yeah, but it doesn't really matter because you don't do any healing anyway. No, that's, that's, that's just, just the only drawback of it. But, I have a question. Uh, so letter plus two with that ability is what it is. I have a question. I'm Tom. Mm -hmm. Okay, fair enough. Uh, does the uh, magic lady that currently has what's his name and the other guy enslaved? <laughs> I don't remember who was enslaved. I'm sorry. Uh, Dara and Wolfram. Okay, fair enough. Thank you. Uh, does she also have a pearl of power? Um, well, we can go to you guys now uh, if you guys are heading there now. Well, I mean, I'm just going to chill by this ball for a bit because so I'm, I'm not exactly. I actually know I need to go there. I can't stop myself from going there. You have to go there as well? Sh okay. Shouldn't we just all go give the report first so we can get the house there and then do our own thing so we're actually making progress? <laughs> I mean, technically, only one person needs just... to make the report. Yeah. I'll it's go make the report or something, of whatever you want to do. <laughs> no, nah, but I, I think it's in the interest of the game to stick to gather as much as we can. Because you guys don't know, he might give like a cash reward or something. You, know? you want to be around for that? Then just take it for yourself. No. no. <laughs> I, I'll be honest, I trust Dara. Yeah. I, I don't know why, but I do. Yeah, that's because of... What? Never mind. He's a hippie. Anyway, well, let, let's just stick together as much as we can. Because uh, Lidith, on the D20 SRD, you can find the normal armor stats of a studded leather, and then you just add two to um, to the armor bonus, and you subtract one of the skill or the, yeah the skill penalty that you get. Uh, yeah, it I'm is automatically it. masterwork, and masterwork means you can subtract one of the skill penalty <laughs> gifts. But it's all on the D20 SRD. Oh shit, this piece of shit's going to fucking Damn. Uh, it's pretty good armor. And uh, I believe you got her old armor. Uh, yeah, first. I got her old one. I right, cool. Okay, cool. Um, so, just uh, can we assume that everyone just goes to House Sanguine and then yeah, get okay. her to the shops or something? Okay. Pretty much, I guess. Go to the city map. Well, you guys aren't far from House Sanguine, for that matter. And around 9 uh, a.m. in the morning, you guys uh, have grouped up and decided on a plan to all go see House Sanguine first, and then travel together uh, to the magic shop in the, the very nice district, somewhere around here. I believe it was called the uh, Rare Caravan or something. Oh, by the way, um, Brian, I also drink my um, medicine. Uh, very good, very good. <laughs> Congratulations! Yeah, 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 thank you, thank you. Yeah, well, uh, let's not forget, right? Yeah, yeah, that's that's your job. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. I, I think everybody else just assumed no, that you drink it, but I actually like that you took the initiative to say you drink it. Mm -hmm. yeah, 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 exactly. Very good. Um, so are we at the... Uh, you guys, yeah, you guys after a while arrive at the entrance of uh, House Sanguine and the door is open. Once uh, inside, you see uh, the secretary sitting behind the desk and uh, saying, Ah, yes, you guys came by last night. And uh, she, she looks at you, Buzz, and goes, uh, Hello. <laughs> You're back too. Oh, well, we were. <laughs> Be still. What does that sound? Well, Radar actually uh, anyway. says that. The fuck was that sound? Uh, Mr. Mr. Green Thumb is ready to see you guys now. If you want, um, he, he's right over there. And she points towards the door to his office. No, 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 no! Don't give me that bullshit. I know secretaries know as much as the boss do. So, what the fuck does my belt do? I ask her. What? Why? What? 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 Oh, we're at House Sanguine, <laughs> dude. Wrong place. Oh, sorry. <laughs> never mind. Yeah, okay, never mind. I'm <laughs> sorry, what did you say? Good <laughs> though. My, well, my heart's just like, sorry, sorry. He's forgot where we are. Right. Where the fuck are we now? Sorry. 
Uh, we're house sanguine, giving the report. Okay, yeah, but we're uh, if, on if, if you like, you can go in now. Uh, yeah, I think all of you should map. wait outside <laughs> to stop this from being more complicated than it needs to be. <laughs> Yeah. Fuck off. Uh, I'm just like, buzz, buzz. I just, just bring him to the side. While we're out yeah. here, you can continue hitting on the uh, secretary. Well, I'm still gonna. Fuck off. You can't tell me what to do. I, I'm oh. not. I'm not. I'm just suggesting. Just suggesting. Alright. Alright. So who goes in to um, uh, speak to Green Thumb? I do. Yeah, but so where are Who follows Dara? Uh, oh, we're I actually moving that away that. from that. All right, yeah, I get it. Yeah, Brian, you probably should have moved our party token. The target token is exactly where it needs to be. Is that, that's how sanguine? Yeah, that big building. That was a mm. Oh. No, that's well, not the pleasure treasury. The, the, the pleasure treasury is right there. <laughs> oh, okay, so no, I was you, wrong. Guys, you guys carry on. I keep on flirting with the secretary. All right, um, all right. Yeah. So Manastina follows Dara. Anyone else? I follow him as well. Uh, I'll Thank stay you. out here. Oh, you're going flirt as well, eh? Lead is no, he's going to make sure you no. don't kill him. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are in House Sanguine, my friend. Come on, focus. <laughs> I think uh, Dar went in, Corvus went in, Menacina went in, and Lidith went in. And Buzz is flirting with the Secretariat. Yep. <laughs> and you go in. Okay, fine. Um, the five of you enter his office, and he is uh, sitting in his chair with his back face to you guys, and he swirls around like, I've been expecting you. I've been you. expecting you. <laughs> oh, really? Does he stroke a cat while doing I just, it? I just really felt like doing that right now. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Alright. Uh, he uh, he goes like, so did you guys uh, bring any news from the from your adventure in the sewers? Well, I step forward, right? Take the documents he told us to fetch out of my bag, just place them on the desk. Oh, uh, did you uh, take the time to read that note on the back of it? Oh shit! No, he didn't. No, I didn't. Well, it's not my business anyway. He yeah, uh, sort of is. He opens up the folder. Did anyone read it? Or the documents? No, I yeah. gave it to you to read because you're the guy who was fucking reading. God damn it. He looks, he looks through it and he goes like, so what do you make of this? I'd, tell me, tell me how you found this. I'd tell you, tell you how we found that. There was a big monster thing at the bottom of a, in your stairs and you killed it. We did hear there reports some... of monsters, but yeah, not, nothing, were... not, nothing big, uh, apparently. Yeah, but... we had to fight through quite a few. Quite a few unpleasant things. Is it is it normal for a city sewers to be? I see. Did you, did you recover the map snakes? that I sent you guys for? Here it is. Oh, did we do actually? Uh, you do. You oh, did actually. Yeah. Oh, well, it's it's the map that. that Bill had. Right. <laughs> I slide it across the table. Interesting. Did you have uh, much ask, trouble ask recovering this? Okay, tell me yeah. more about where you got it. All right, we got it off a dead body, didn't we? Uh, turn back on the couple yeah. of guys. Go for that body. Yeah, dead body. You actually <laughs> got it from Bill, the map. Oh, from Bill? Which one's... Oh, it's uh, Vermin Supreme. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we got it from the crazy guy with the blue on his head. Dude, you we guys were... saw him as well. Yeah, we were going to bring him up for questioning, but he seemed harmless. So. Yeah, that's that's what I said before I sent you in there. Yeah. But what did you learn anything else about him, though? I told him what we learned about him. Cheers. He calls himself the cannibal. Because <laughs> I, honest, I honestly can't. Uh, if I remember correctly, he's a wizard or mage of some sort that was down there for research, research. into... For like, evolution. Yeah, something about evolution. And he oh. said people called him the cannibal. Despite yes, never we... eating anybody. Oh, yeah. I see. Well, that may have just been a great misunderstanding then. I would hope so. Very well. So he got the map. Did he tell you where he got it from? We didn't bother asking. <laughs> I see. I'm afraid we'll never know the fate of poor Jeff. Have you guys mm. tried to punch him in the face? I mean, if, if there were that many creatures down there, including the huge one, then I think we know the fate of poor Jeff. Well, it's probably the it was a black pudding that could have dissolved. We can assume, but it would have been nice to claim to rest, if you know what I mean. That's it. Like, you should probably send quite a few sets of adventurers down into those sewers because I don't think that's good for, like, 
to, when your oh. infrastructure is like plagued by monsters, that can't be we great. We did lay some traps in the hopes of catching a few of them. You ended up catching me and Wolfram. I did? I'm terribly sorry. I did say I didn't remember where the traps were. It's all on this map. Question. How does one catch a black ooze with a, a pitfall of snakes? No, that's... We never... Never heard of it. What about a giant mm -hmm. crystal? How, 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 does, how does one catch a golden made of teeth with a pitfall of snakes? <laughs> He, he, I'm sorry. I can't. I, I, I can't. I come from. I come for answers, and all I guess is questions. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. Trying to about ask this. guy how to get fish. He's so you're saying you did not put the pit of snakes into your? Oh, the pit of snakes we put there. Yes, we found it. <laughs> they got we, caught it. <laughs> we, sorry, yes, we sorry, found it. We found it. We found your pit of snakes. You might. You might need more. Some more snakes, actually. He, he looks like killing all of them. Like, you actually got out. That's amazing. Can you tell me more about that, actually? Uh, uh I let I will I will let Wolfram tell you the story. Wait, 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 wait. Of killing all the snakes. You are a goddamn bard. Uh, Do your fuck. job, motherfucker. Well, I, I, just point, I just I just point to Wolfram. This is how we got out. We we killed all the snakes, all of them. Really? I, I, I killed like I, I killed most of the small ones with the sonic burst. Oh. I kind of feel bad about not knowing where the traps were because those snakes didn't do anything uh, wrong. Oh well. well. Guess we'll have to refill those. Yeah. <laughs> Snake lives matter. Alright, well, Snake this is good to know though. Uh, is there anything more you can tell me about your little sewer adventure? Well, there were cultists, an altar, and a really big thing that completely pulps one of our party cultists? members with a single. Yes, cultists. Okay. That's Don't first. forget to mention the giant blood hulk thing that one yes, guy. Um, <laughs> yeah, we had there was a giant thing where we think it's a blood hulk. Jesus Christ! Where, so and where did you see you found it. this? Hmm? In the sewers. Just... He, he he looks. Uh, I, he, I point I, I point out on the map where exactly it is. I, um, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, he he uh, shoves right. the sewer map in front of you and asks you where it was. Right. Yeah, I see. Can yes, I, yes, boss. Can I can I make you listen, sir? No, you're sure. still flirting. You can make a decision. Because this this is the fucking worst reporting I ever heard. <laughs> I doubt you're gonna do a lot. <laughs> you you nothing apparently... beyond uh, the door. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, right. Anyway, tell him about the blood hulk. Tell him about the cultists. Tell him about the monsters. Show him. I, I show him. Uh, what's called one of the teeth from the like um, fang golem it was. Yeah. Wait, did you grab one of those? Just a spike, yeah. I guess it was. I yeah. did. Spike. I have like five of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, right? So oh, cool. yes. no, we did have reports of some spiky creature in there. I didn't right. think it would be. Don't forget to spiky. mention the spider it fucking annihilated. Oh, yeah, there was a spider that annihilated. There's always been spiders in the sewers, guys. Tell him about the headless limb demon. No, you guys can just tell him straight up because you're standing right there. You don't have to tell yeah. the person standing next <laughs> Like, this is the funniest shit. Like, I, I'm, <laughs> I'm saying that because I'm not in there. The rest of you can just say I, 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 I think it's funny, it's like, tell him about the thing, oh yeah, there's a thing. Tell him about how I turned into an elf. Yeah. Uh, in fact, this is when he notices uh, Corvus more closely, because he was there, but he just figured, you know, it was a group of people that he knew was yeah. a group of people, but then he, he looks at Corvus after Corvus opened his mouth, and he goes like, wait a second, who are you? I've never seen you before. Mm. I'm the new guy, I tell him. <laughs> yeah, you're not in any of my reports. Who are you? Uh, I got murdered, so I ended up being <laughs> I turned you... into a fabulous elf. So I'm, no sense. I'm Corvus. Can I do a normal He listen? said he was Corvus. Long silence. What? Long silence. It, oh. <laughs> okay, I, I won't. I said I won't wrap this up. Boys. Okay. Okay. We wanted to, we were exchanging this for information, wasn't it? Corvus wanted to know something, and it was scratch. What's all? You scratch my back, I scratch your back, and we went into the sewers to get the thing. So, uh -huh. what was it, Corvus, that you wanted to know before? Can I do another listen check, Brian? Mm -hmm. No, you can't. <laughs> go ahead. He just said I did. Yeah, go ahead. Make one. Hey, nice. hey. Okay, you are now up against. You the door, hear Lidith explaining uh, how Corvus got back. Alright, can, can I barge in? 
You can do whatever you want. Totally yeah. I, I, I put my hand on his shoulder. Please, please don't. No. Dude, like, no. <laughs> with other people in there. Fuck off, I'm doing this. I, I barge. Said, please. Nope, 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 no buts. Fuck it. Okay, no. I grab one. <laughs> Oh yeah, you want to grapple me, Full you motherfucker. <laughs> do it! You don't have a proof grapple, do you? I do. Alright, grapple me, Dad. Yeah, you do, okay. Alright, roll it, roll it and grapple you, son of a bitch. I, I need to make sure I have my message right on the ground. Well, first he, needs to roll a, first he needs to roll a touch attack. Well, I, was already, I already had my hand on his shoulder. Oh yeah, that's right. No, you haven't. I was flirting with waitress or the secretary. There is there is a difference in having a hand on the shoulder and actually getting into position to grab them. So roll attach attack. Okay, fine. Uh, I guess I would just need my regular attack. Oh, oh. That, that that definitely hits the target. That hits, yes. And now uh, roll on the post grapple check, guys. Trying to measure dexterity. Ah, I'm sorry. Oh, shit. Uh, it's it's base attack bonus plus strength plus any other modifier. So. Oh, then it's even higher. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Now you you uh, bitterly fail. Well, um, it's then an opposed I... check, motherfucker. I have to make the check first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What, well, mate? Well, um. No, I, he still I, has to make the check, boys. What? Well, base attack bonus. He plus hasn't. Strength he hasn't rolled. Plus, he hasn't rolled plus extra, extra modifiers. Okay, so that'll be... Oh, that's okay. an extra, you have so an extra Buzz, four, what is your base attack? Buzz, your base attack is, I believe, just eight, right? Uh, my base okay. attack is... Yeah, eight. And your strength is? It, uh, my, just roll your total attack, goddammit. My strength is uh, plus five. Okay, so plus 13. Uh, you rolled a 30 instead of 21. What? You rolled 30 instead of 21. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, that, that worked for me. Okay, so I've got 5 plus 4, which is 9, plus 4 from Improved Grapple, so I have plus 13. Yeah. So I can hopefully... Good beat him. I did not. Hey! Oh. You did not. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> you boy! Still on your grapple. And Actually, Buzz wait, bursts wait, wait, wait. into That's the room. Right. All right. Wait, 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 wait. You don't... Add improve your your base attack bonus. I don't think. I thought it was yeah, your no, strength. You do. For deck. For a grapple, you do. Oh. Well. For a post grapple, you do. Yeah. Oh, uh, that means we've been doing it wrong. Shit. No, we aren't. <laughs> Anywho. Yeah, you can, can definitely That's try okay. to trip us. Oh no! <laughs> I like the opposition. Like, yeah. no. This is great. This is great. <laughs> They're all against Don't you. Get yeah. through the room. Do you have improved trip, Manistina? Stop them! Anyone, stop them! Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone wants to stop the fucking belligerent the barrier. <laughs> I should have raged. I should have raged. Uh, you do have improved trip, that's nice, so you don't provoke an attack of opportunity. And I make a trip attempt! I like how we are actually using our secondary skills to... Uh, really to stop me from, from entering a room! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you guys are doing great, guys. Ah, oh, god. Alright, now make a melee touch attack, uh, <coughs> just your normal attack roll. Yeah, Actually, roll uh, fucking one, wouldn't you? Depending on what weapon she, uh, like, if she doesn't have a weapon drop, she just uses her foot, I guess. Yeah, she just tries to trip him as he bursts into the door. He doesn't have a weapon drawn because no one, none of you guys have. Base oh, attack is your uh, strength, so just your normal, normal melee attack. Plus four for improved trip. Oh, you have improved trip. Plus four then, yes. Twelve. <laughs> and you can actually punch him when he goes down. No way. Yeah, this is just for the. This is just a melee touch attack, and then you can make oh. the trip. Yeah. yeah. Honestly, I find that a weird system. You have to make two rolls, one with the trip and one without. It yeah, and really now hurts. roll. Yeah, that's uh, that hits. And then you rolled your strength or dex, whichever is higher. Well, oh, then you 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 roll your strength versus the opponent's strength or dex, whichever is higher. Yeah, but um, sorry, what do I have to roll now? Your if, one if your attack if your attack succeeds, make a strength check opposed by your defender's dexterity or strength. But you don't add your uh, base stack bonus for this. Yeah. Okay, just so just strength. Your strength is probably highest, Buzz, so you make yeah, a yeah, d20 yeah, yeah. plus your strength modifier. 
Aww. Aww. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did you add the extra four from the improved trip? Or no, you did not add the extra four of your improved trip. Oh. <laughs> you actually rolled higher. Oh. And Buzz, as you burst into the in, in, into the office, Manistina sticks out a foot and you fall flat on your face. Well, and no, Wolfram, no, you can no, jump on no, him and no, try no, to restrain him. Wolfram has still one attempt left. Uh, Wolfram can try to grapple you now. Yep. This is like wrestling. This is but this is fucking like crazy. I'm, I'm just shaking my head, just like, okay, and, and then I go back to giving the report. <laughs> they're all, they're all like, yeah, yeah, this is our barbarian. All right. you know, that, this, this is Buzz. Wolverham, first off, do you have improved grapple? He wouldn't. I don't think you do, right? Mm. So, uh, what do okay. you do now? Uh, so, Buzz, okay. you do get an attack of opportunity, but you uh, uh, take it at a minus four because you're now prone. Well, I'm prone? Yes. Yeah, yeah you got tripped. Trip. What? How did you, I get you fall, you fall flat on your face after Manistina tripped you. Uh, Manistina actually rolled four higher than that, so it was a 22 against your 20. Well, She no, forgot no. to add improved trip. Ah, oh, motherfucker. <laughs> uh, I I help Wolfram. So. Well, you know what? I will make an attack of opportunity then. Fucking yeah, ass. No oh, oh, shit. You don't get an attack of opportunity. What the fuck are you talking about? No, he doesn't what? have improved grapple when you're on the floor. But he still gets an attack of opportunity to start to grapple him, even if he's prone. But did okay, you reduce enough. the four from that plus thirty? No. Uh, anyway. Uh, that'll that'll still hit. Don't worry. Yeah. yeah. I love how <laughs> Ro it, or not Ro, Buzz is rolling so high against his own goddamn party members. I'm <laughs> <laughs> uh, Yeah, you uh, you uh, hit him with your fist for no one d four, just a one d four plus your strength. Oh, uh, uh, d four. So, yeah, yeah. My bad. For me. Oh, I thought. It's not lethal though. So. Is your strength plus five? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I wow, am a stupid okay. bell. Oh, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, yeah. his, his, his unarmed is 1d4? He noticed that your beard uh, grew up to the uh, length of your regular knees. Regular unarmed is 1d4. That is no, it's, right. it's, it's your uh, No, it's, it's, uh, it's, you, one plus your strength. When did it, did it turn to? No, 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 no. What? what the fuck is are you that? talking about? It's 1d4 plus 5 non-lethal. Oh, okay. Plus strength non-lethal. Okay. Yeah, you, uh, do <sighs> 9 non-lethal damage to Wolverham. Wolverine, right. you take a punch to the face as you try to grapple him. Now roll a post grapple checks, guys. And once again, I'm helping him. <laughs> so we and both get to make. Grapple is a just. Terrain damage? Uh, it, and a post grapple Strength is. Strength plus just... attack, yeah. total attack. It's, it's really attack. Yeah, it's just a melee attack plus any modifiers. Oh, that's pretty low. Yeah, I was just gonna use if they fell, I would just use the hideous laugh jar, and you guys could just drag him out because he can't take any actions. All right, Buzz rolled pretty fucking hard. You high. do whatever you have to do to stop me, mate. So I don't care. I'm a fucking barbarian, fucker. You're not the only what? barbarian here, motherfucker. Well, over him. Base it down. Nice. Your That's supposed to be a roll. Good job, man. I was I trying mean, to make a very hard. Oh. Wow. 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 Well, I mean, we'll, we'll from. Uh, oh. Uh, anyway, Buzz, you wait. are. You like, oh. like, sort of. You punch him uh, aside. <laughs> but now Maynard's got him in the full Nelson. Well, can, can, I, can I post that check as well? Yep. Yeah, you have to. Yeah. Actually, it's uh, I mean, I mean that, is your, that is your punch attack. Hold on. Uh, yeah, you don't have to post that check. You know, Maynard's roll against that. You definitely. No, that, that was my opposed check. Oh, no, oh, you're full check. Okay, you win. Yeah. Uh, you're now grappling with Maynard. That's right. <laughs> well, well, well rather, since that's the opposed just, check, I'm... Just assume a dwarf entered the area, and, like, he got jumped by five people, like, shaking. <laughs> so... you, first you got tripped, then you got tried to grapple. You haven't gotten up yet, so you're still on the floor, but then Maynard grapples you. Yeah, exactly. So, for all intents and purposes, I'm grappled now. 
Yeah, I, I have not pinned them. Yeah, you're, you're grappling. It doesn't mean you're, like, grabbed or put into any position. Yeah, you're, like, yeah, fighting I, together. I, you're, I like, know. In, I, I know, you're, like, rolling over the floor together. And well, since I won the opposed check, I can choose to damage or pin, so I pin them. Yes. They're, they're, for all intents and purposes, there's now a dwarf on the floor, like, go run. Can't trip someone who's broke. Yeah, guys, I need to take a piss. I'll hurry up. <laughs> okay, so he's on the floor. Does anybody have a sleep-like spell or anything like that? For the love of God. I will hold it first. took you like four or five attempts to like even get me down. I'm proud it of It took me. two attempts. One from me and one from me. Oh, school, mate. You, you know how much attempt it took. Yeah, two to get you on the floor because Manistee tripped you on the second. Yeah, but then, then again, oh yeah, fair enough. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fair game, fair game. <laughs> this is hilarious. I've actually always wanted to see who would win in a grapple contest between us. <laughs> I guess we know now. Yeah, fuck off, mate. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because you were in such a hurry, and now you ended up wasting more time. But it's it's right? funny. Oh well, I'm not in a hurry, mate. Don't worry about that. <laughs> you, yeah, you're you're not in a hurry. Not, not right now, at least. <laughs> no, no, not anymore. <laughs> <laughs> if we got to bread something we can use to entangle him. Okay, thank you, Lele. You fucking gay owl. Well, fucker. technically speaking, if you've uh, got a spell components pouch, you have a branch. Yeah. Having a spell component pouch just means you are assumed to have whatever you need for your spells for a day. <laughs> All right, I'm back. Oh, welcome, welcome back, back mate. All right, you so where it. were we? Well, I'm restrained on the ground. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, well, not necessarily restrained. Mamie is on top of you, and you guys are now like, like grappling. I, I, I call that restrained. Sure. I, yeah, technically, I won the opposed check, so I can pin him. Well, At this point, the uh, green thumb, after mean, having witnessed all this stuff, you know, he raises well, his one eyebrow. And he goes I... like, uh, so what is the meaning of this then? Uh, it's it's just some internal party <laughs> strife. We'll we'll deal with it, sir. Just don't worry about it. Let's get back to the report. Uh, please get these people out of my office then. If uh, if I, we're, my office we're, is we're out of for internal strife. We are trying to <laughs> believe me. <laughs> you dwarf, get out. <laughs> I, I just look at him, sir, please don't antagonize him. I don't know how long I can hold him. <laughs> he looks at the dwarf and he goes like, I don't think we'll have a problem, will we, dwarf? And he uh, he rolls a buff check. Please, okay. please, please don't oh, sorry, sound racist, sir. Uh, my bad, intimidate check. Oh, God. Yeah, you can roll, uh, I don't know, what's his motive, isn't it? It's not uh, sense motive, it's, it's uh, a, it's a... I'm fairly sure it's a will save. It's, it's will save, I think, sorry. Okay, and, make um, a will save, just for the fun of it. Unless you're using the Interminate rules in the Book of Nine Swords. Oh, that was his own thing. Um, to demoralize... Doesn't matter, I'd make a will save. I want him to roll a will save. Cool. After all this shit has happened to bad to him, buzzed. Well, we'll yeah, what yet. yeah what, what do you need me to do, Mac? I want you to roll the wheel say. Oh, that's good. Because now I'm got, I'm obviously raging. Okay. Oh shit. No, no. He has to. It's it's a modified say. level check, so it's one d twenty plus character's level plus target's wisdom bonus. And any any modifiers versus fear. So it's one d twenty plus eight plus Buzz's wisdom, and, and that's I the checking. I rolled thirty seven. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that won't work. Well, okay, okay, so you're intimidated. No, no, uh, it's, it's, yeah, you are, uh, like when this guy tells you that you have to get out right now because he's no, uh, fuck that bullshit. No, I'm he's being impatient. You definitely think it is it is way better for you to just get up. Forget for now what happened here and uh yeah, fuck off you motherfucker. Then outside. I don't get that shit from you. Uh, actually give me a second while I do the the actual like thing for uh, plus five is 
13, 13 plus 19, 30, oh, you, 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 most of all, you failed the save by five. Ah, well. Actually, actually, I started antagonizing Buzz myself. <laughs> oh, oh, what the fuck is this kind of shit? <laughs> I also oh, yeah. want the human on top of him out as well. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, let's that's, that's the plan. Yeah. And, and let's just say I kicked half of you out of the way, but in the end, you dragged me out of the room, and all is good now. Oh, I was just going to sit there and antagonize you until you chased me. <laughs> oh, my, I fucking will. <laughs> then do it. <laughs> Bring it more for you. Okay, I'll, I'll, ch I'll, ch I'll chase. I'll chase. Uh, I'll yeah. chase. I'll chase. Okay, I, I fucking book it. All right, you run out of the front door. Oh, just God. Just waiting in the street, like hopping from one leg to the other, waiting for Buzz to come closer. And then when he does, where do you go? Left or right? Left. All right. Buzz, you seem to go left. Or right from your perspective. I'll, I'll follow him left. Okay, you follow. Uh, you guys disappear outside. You, you know the uh, concern. You know the concern face that my skeleton is making. <laughs> yeah, that's that, that, that's that's that right now. Like, uh. <laughs> All right, so wait, wait, uh, bro, there's bro. four people um, remaining standing okay. in that office right now. Is Corvus, Manistee, and Alita? Yeah. Oh wait, there's still five. Right, back to the report. Right, back to the report. I give him the rest of the inf information that we have. <laughs> like, I can't, I cannot be asked to do any nar narration right now. <laughs> too, I'm too, I'm too embarrassed by what, by, by what's going through. I would just like, give, I give him a hasty report, like slide the little piece of paper across the table with all the like, like minor details. Tell him he should probably get a, a good set of adventures down there with um, pest control. Tell him. Clean up, you're saying, saying, huh? No, yeah, I no. mean, <coughs> if, I mean, so I know adventures that would take unkindly to being called a cleaning up crew, but it's obviously whatever you call them, but less cleanup I mean, crew, more you, do complete you think annihilation. Down there? Oh, definitely. We are only in a very small part of the series, and if that, and if that part of the series is any indication of your infrastructure, then you guys are sitting, basically sitting <coughs> on a time bomb. Soon they'll have like if there's so many down there like they they probably have their own like if they form like a little kingdom they could just invade up here. It's ridiculous. Hmm. That said though, can I um, request something from you people? We're not going back down to the sewer, sir. No, we don't. I don't need you to go back down to the sewer. However, yeah. uh, I'm not sure if you know, but tomorrow there's another council meeting. All right. What? I could use help in acquiring a bigger budget for. Uh, you know, keeping track of all this stuff down in the sewers, because that oh, is God. my responsibility, however. What are you talking oh, about, man? Oh, we're going to have to pick a side. Well, seriously, Corvus, we need you to remember what it was that we came here for to begin with. Because there's, there's something that you need, you really needed, and then you were begging him for, and then I stepped and I was like, scratch your back, scratch, I, I scratch your back, you scratch ours, and then we go into the sewer. Oh, I really need you to remember what he wanted. That's something to do with the like, I no, think. no, no. It was you personally, the other thing. The blood whatevers. Oh, the blood letter. The information brokers. The people who, uh... Ah, uh, shit. So we needed information, like information brokers. Thing. Yeah, okay. Though anything mm -hmm. he knows about the serial killer would also be helpful. Yeah. He looks at you guys, and he, uh, he then looks at Corvus, and he goes like, Who is this guy? Again? Uh, remember the hey. tiefling from earlier? You mean Corvus? Yeah, yeah he got punched yeah. to dust. Uh, this is Corvus now. I smile and I wave. <laughs> he got punched pretty. He surprised? He looks very surprised. Uh, also, okay. uh, the guy sitting next to him that you, of course, know as Atticus. Uh, okay. he also looks very surprised. Right. He was like, I Imagine. see, and he's that yeah. now? Yes. I know, yes. I <laughs> smile and I wave uh, again. <laughs> I draw attention to what Lydeth just said. Ro, take a second to read that. You do this and you... Because the cultists I mean, weren't the killers. Surprisingly. I don't see uh, how I can help you with getting out of the way of the collectors. 
uh, area for that matter. But uh, if you mean you need access to the sewers, then you just tell me where you want to go and I'll make sure that you have the key uh, to that area. Uh, Manistina, this would be the time where you point out we need the key to the area where we found that body. <coughs> I highly doubt you can convince Mr. William. Fuck it. Do I know about it? Can I try to convince them? Even though I suck at convincing people. Sorry? Ah, uh, shit. Oh. <laughs> As a, uh, while I am flattered, Lighter, I don't think I can convince uh, I don't exactly have much sway in this city. <laughs> and I'm not like I'm not familiar with their internal politics. I'm I'm just a, I'm just a magic student, dude. You only know Sarah, what Clover had told you on the yeah. way to Adamantine City, uh, and that is that uh, House Roderick uh, in the middle of uh, mostly influential in the middle part of the city, but in a sense the leader of the houses. Uh, they're pretty close to uh, House Brolin, which is the orange part of the city map. Mm. And uh, House Brolin is like the house of the tax collectors, or the collectors in general, as they're called, uh, okay. which are mostly just dwarven town guards or city guards. Then okay. No one really likes those two houses, except for the rich and the dwarfs, I suppose. Um, then there's like the trade district, which is where House Krag is, uh, and they house are getting Krag taxed. Yeah. yeah, House Krag is uh, the first house you guys came in contact with when Herbert Moistback uh, greeted you guys at the docks. Okay, I and we House Krag, okay. yeah, the House Krag is yeah. pretty much in charge of uh, commerce and entertainment. Uh, okay, however, they're taxed yeah. very heavily uh, by the city itself, and they mm -hmm. are requiring more or uh, a bigger budget to help uh, defend the city against outer uh, forces and he does believe in the, in the things that you guys are chasing uh, like, like the cultists and the end of the world and all that shit okay. and so now, he's, uh, he's, he's offered you guys help sorry <laughs> and now this guy does too because <laughs> they were in his yeah. sewers well, you're bloody fucking grateful I'm not being here right now. Plot you know? points. Main plot. Uh, everyone is getting taxed. Well, to be, I mean, he, he, he looks at Lilith and he, uh, he goes, Well, to be fair, I mean, only a few people have been killed by this so-called there, And I don't see uh, this harming any of the houses, so that might explain their... I don't know. There, disambiguation. Same thing. Okay, so is uh, am I correct in this, bro? The thingy that I've just put on the screen. I mean, for me, the murder of Delio is the main plot point. But you think so? For me, personally, yes. All right. So we'll so we can swap that around. Uh, and we keep the, we keep thinking about murder and stuff, and we seem to be all going on different things. We need we need you an guys... idea of the end game here. Guys, but the I end game, for, for that matter, um, Maynard has gone to House Crack and got that missive that was sent by Ariador, telling okay. you guys to find his uh, his old party members because there's oh, okay. something there's really something afoot. Okay, so and I made the theory that that orc that pulled off a dragon turtle head is probably the guy we're looking for. And you guys know that there is um, some sort of orc outpost outside of uh, the city. Uh, where a bunch of adventurers and heroes have been sent to and never returned. Okay. And so, we can ask... What, what's stopping us from going straight there? there? Well... Nothing... Uh, really because there. we're supposed to go to that council meeting in a day. Uh, uh yes, House Krog uh, asked you guys to help okay. him. So we've been doing stuff in the city to kill time until that. And hopefully find the murderer. Yes, which yeah, just is because we day. had so many sessions. We had so many sessions. I've comp I had... I had completely forgotten about the dragon turtle guy. I had completely forgotten about <laughs> Ariador. I was so caught up in my like Hogwarts slash uh, what's called my in my magic tower schooling and uh, being the slave of the also part time worker at the magic shop that I had yeah. completely forgotten about everything. And so it's good to get us back on track. So currently, we have the miss. We have the 
How, how's Craig asking us to do what exactly? Uh, to help Get you more secure uh, a higher budget for the defense of the city, because he believes in uh, uh, awakening evil forces and all that stuff. Okay, um, we think that's a good idea. We need this. Everyone else is getting taxed as well. Uh, yes. So we know and why all the money is disappearing? How Sanguine just asked you guys to help him get a bigger budget to secure the the sewer sections of the entire city. Um, uh, I have a feeling this this is a recurring theme. Everywhere that everywhere that we go seems to be wanting a bigger budget. So the problem is where the money is coming from. All right. Mhm. Mm and. Since everyone's getting taxed more, that means there must have been a shift in power or something. So they, we need to go to the council meeting to find out who the shady characters are who might be hogging all the money for the voters. Oh, you definitely already know that House Runerick, the, the richest house of the city, the are dickheads. Uh, is being run by William Runerick, who is yes. put in charge by Balthazar, the king himself. Mm -hmm. uh, well, to, to, to I'm just the politics now instead of like actually playing the game. It's like the first, like the first episode of uh, mm -hmm. Star Wars. Okay, so what we need to do is attend council meeting, see if there's anything wrong with this Roderick chap, and turn this thing into like a five-way democracy, like meritocracy. We just need, we just need to fix this thing's just like political, like social, economic landscape, and then when that is done, we can actually go adventuring. We I mean, to be fair, we've been adventuring pretty hard down in those sewers. Yeah, that was pretty fucking sick. <laughs> We're gonna ask the blood letters if they know anything about every other people, I guess. Okay, so anyway, now that uh... we now that we are back on track with the plot and we know what's doing, we've just given them the thing. We now know that everyone's getting taxed. Not Corvus just mentions uh, the blood letters in front of him. Uh, yeah. You guys explain that he is indeed Corvus. Yeah. Uh, he goes like, uh, yes, no, I'm sorry, I do not have any. Uh, knowledge about that. However, Corpus, I would like to talk to you uh, afterwards. I am so dead. I am so okay. dead. <laughs> okay, we, uh, I, I say, okay, down. there's your report. Do we get, um, are we expecting a remun remuneration for the services we did in clearing out the monsters and finding your pieces of paper? Yes, you guys did admirably. And he opens up a drawer and he mm -hmm. uh, drops a pouch, uh, which definitely sounds like coins inside right. on the on the desk there you mm -hmm. go um i expect your guys uh help during the next or during the council meeting later today yes uh we will at least one of us will make sure to be there and i'm hoping it will be me but if boss shows up that's going your council meeting is going to be fun i don't even know where <laughs> i am it's <this> mom mate <laughs> oh, that's yeah i I've right. sort of just led him around town and i at yeah. some point i lost him Right. Because I can yeah. move more than twice okay. movement. Right. I, you love him. You love him. That's right. I will try to be at the council meeting at least. And I tip my hat, and then Finley kind of like comes out and he tips his hat. And <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. you help was much appreciated. I hope we can continue our business later. Yeah, I nod and I say, okay, round up, let's go. I stay. Yeah, you you stay. And I tap Corvus on the shoulder. Meet us outside when you're done. I am going to die. I'm going to get shanked. I'm, sh I'm sure it's not. I'm sure it's not that bad. And what's the worst worst case scenario? You'll just get revived again. You can't. Oh. You can't. I mean, you can't. Get, it can be much worse. <laughs> you already died. Die um, Ro, I'm not going back. Yes. Fine. Where am I at this point? I will tell you in a in a second. Uh, I'm All going right. to. Go with Corvus to the main chat and only talk to him. Dark, you are free to join us, of course, to record. Oh, yeah. What? The main chat. Um, yeah. Right. yeah, so Great. just so, um, just so no one else can listen in. Oh, that's a point. How much coin do we get? How much coin? Uh, do you haven't like counted it yet, but you think it's more than 2,000. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Uh... Hello, Corvus. Hello? Can you hear me? So, yes. Okay. Um, okay. You are the last one to stay uh, to stay there, and uh, the okay. door closes behind you. He uh, he waits uh, a further few minutes, which are pretty awkward. No one says a thing. And uh, he then looks at Atticus and then looks at you, and he goes, Corvus, 
You know we don't speak aloud of the blood letters. It is important. I told them because we needed information. We still do not speak aloud of the blood. You know the price or the penalty for doing so. I forgot. Don't you kindly remind me. <laughs> you know that it is death. Well, however, it seems you uh, pretty much paid the price for that already, haven't you, buddy? I smile at him. And I nod. Indeed. Alright. Uh, I actually have an assignment for you. Buzz, <laughs> fuck off. Yeah, no. <laughs> fuck off. I was a bit late. Fuck bad. off. Yeah, well, I'm here now, Emma. Move it. Well, I'm here now. Fuck no, off. No, you're not. All right, good. So, <laughs> I have an assignment for you. Good. I um. If I do this, will you allow us to have information that we need? Uh, what what kind of information do you need? Tell me more. I want information about Eriador's companion. I see. I, uh... I've only recently heard about Eriador's return. Um, however, I'm not very familiar with his companions, you say. I've, there's, a. Uh, well, what, what can you tell me? Let's, let's start there. Oh, fuck. Ah, uh, the notepad. Crap. Would you allow me to, like, ask Maynard for the names because I literally forget. I had forgot about them. Would you allow that, bro? Yeah, go ahead. You, you, you know the names to be uh, Smash and the Orc. Mm -hmm. uh, Tia Mule, or, yeah, Tia Mule, the Elven Cleric. Paul, Cam Paul Camo Dodge to be... Uh, you actually not sure of the race, but you know that he is a caster of sorts. And finally, the bald monk. Uh, shit, what was his name again? Mao Mao Chen? Was that? I it? think so. <laughs> I think so. Shit. Uh, oh. Mao Chen or something. Bauchin or Malchin? I can't remember. Didn't, I didn't fucking write it down. <laughs> Shit, where is it? Uh, Maynard's gonna post it. Uh, I think it's Malchin. Let's just wait. Oh, yes. <clears throat> there we go. Thank yeah, you. it is Malchin, okay. I tell him the names of the companions, and I tell him if he knows anything about them. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. No, I don't. Do you at least have any sliver of information about any of them? Well, what can you tell me about these people? Mao Perhaps Chen I will know a... something if you tell me some details. Mao Chen is a very, very strong monk who can punch a thousand, was it demons, I think, with a single punch. Eddie, uh, that sounds something. like a fairy tale, my friend. Smashan is a very powerful orc, a berserker. He can tear down things with his axe. Talk Wait, axe you say an orc? Yes. Mm, there have been sightings of orc raiding parties uh, around this city for the past few weeks Can you tell actually me you i believe there is uh an outpost outside of town where a bunch of people have been sent to but never came back do you know where they hail from i do not but i assume like all orcs they come from the broken isles Do you know anything about dog person? About sorry? Uh, about um, I have no clue how to pronounce that. Palcamo Dodge. Palcamo Dodge. No, I'm afraid it's the first time I hear of that name. Do you know anything about polymorphing? 
like maybe they transform into something. I know wizards keep themselves busy with stuff like that, but I'm no wizard. Last question. Do you know what happened in the ranger fort south of here? I, um, I heard reports that it was quite a massacre. Uh, it's been a while ago, but apparently some single individual was responsible for this. Uh, however, the identity of said individual is uh, fortunately unknown. Why? What is it to you? Oh, wait. You have been recruited into that fort, haven't you? Maybe. What am I to do? Hmm. Well, if you do find out, do let me know. This is some information that I, as well, am interested in. Um, what are you going to make me do? I think perhaps my friend, Hero Look of You, will be able to help you. You told and, me I uh, have to do something. I have no idea. My friend is, does, isn't really talkative when it comes to his uh, matter of affairs, but we are good friends and should be fine. Especially uh, with your new form, he should be more inclined to listen to you. As well as help you. So what is this thing? Hmm? You told me you wanted me to do something for you. Uh, yes, actually, what I want you to do is to go see my friend here, look at you, because I believe he needs some help with some stuff. And uh, I believe that uh, the person of your caliber, uh, as well as your new form, quite interesting, I have to say, uh, will uh, greatly help him in his endeavor. Okay. So where is he? Oh, he's Hero Lukaville. He's the leader of House Lukaville. Lukaville. I nod, and uh, I guess... Okay, is there anything else I can help you with? Would you be able to uh, acquire a bag of holding for me? I seem to have mine. He, he raises an eyebrow. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> well then, I smile, I nod, and I leave. Okay, you leave, and let's go join the others again. Hi I'm guys. taking a train all the way over oh, to. to I'm talking about something else. Yeah, we, they took a train all the, all the way over to a, a whole other county to just go fight their their lads. Uh, um, all right, yeah, 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 yeah. right, Buzz. Yeah. yeah. After about uh, an hour of being led through the uh, like streets <laughs> and uh, parts of town, uh, you oh, have yeah, absolutely yeah. no fucking clue where the fuck you are. Uh, you, I you was think... saying that I, I was like leading him around here, like in the area of the pre pleasure territory. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Wherever you think you are, know so at fun. least that you are still in the South End district, and um, you know, considering the houses around you and stuff. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. Um, what kind of people do I see? Uh, not many people at this point in the day. Uh, it's pretty late at night. It's just normal. Wait, uh, that time. I thought it was morning. Oh, sorry. Yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's morning. I... Otherwise, we missed that thing. Oh, yeah, that's true. What, what, time, what time is the council meeting? Uh, the council meeting is around midday. Uh, it cool. is now okay. around 10-ish. So, is there a clock um, tower or something? Uh, so, however, for yeah. Buzz, it's around 11-ish. 11-ish? Yeah, he -ish. would once into the future. Uh, <laughs> there, there, are, there are churches and clock towers. So, oh, okay, yeah. so so we'll know what time it. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm not, I'm not very familiar with like that kind of shit. We're just a um, yeah. I approach the next person I meet. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's just some uh, some guy who looks to be uh, heading towards work with some tools on his uh, shoulder. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't care about that. Um, I approach him and ask where the fuck I am. Well, you'd be in the Southern District, of course. 
Peter Sparrow Street, you're on. Fuck off! Okay, I'm back on my phone. I ask him what I am. He so, answered you very succinctly about where you were. He gave you the answer. Brother, you're and in a you... sparrow! You're in a sparrow street, I just said, mate. I'm sorry, are you lost? Yes! I, I wanted to go to the council meeting. The council meeting? Is that what? That would be in the center of town, wouldn't it be? <laughs> yeah, well, where the bloody fuck am I? Yes, <laughs> oh, like I said, you're in the southern district on the sparrow street. Ask what? for the what? pleasure what? treasury. Why you talk English to me, you fucking... <laughs> I think I'm perfectly. I'm talking. Okay, I'm sorry. I, don't uh, have I have to get to work. I'm sorry. Uh, all right. Work. Yeah, I, I had enough of this. All right. I have the I think there was something going on. What's his Why, mess? Why is he so angry? <laughs> He's angry at everything, and probably because you, uh, I was waiting around town for. In the end, you meet a you meet a friendly dwarf person who seems to be lost as well. But at least they no, know I where to go. Then. What's his armor class? Tom, just please, for the love of God, let Ro do it. Don't kill. Tom. Don't kill anyone for the love of God. No, you're I'm going just... to jail. It's one d four. Oh wait, oh wait, you're actually attacking the person that first. Yeah. Talk? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah, you hit him, and you hit him for eleven damage, and uh, you. It, it would be oh too God! Did I kill him? You uh, did kill him. Yes. Oh. No, it's not lethal. It's not lethal. No, he this. attacked with his axe, didn't he? No, no, his. No, 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 no. If I. Do you think his axe does one d six? Sorry, sorry, my bad. <laughs> no, 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 and that's no, still no, supposed no, to be one d four. Alright, then re-roll. Yeah. Re-roll for non lethal damage. What? One d four. Like one d four plus. Uh, oh, d four. Oh, yeah. Okay. I mean, fine. Our commoner still only has about five hit points anyway, so. Yeah, you knock him the fuck out. <laughs> <and you> <laughs> Uh, this, this guy who doesn't understand what you wanted and try to continue on gets punched so hard in the face that he goes fucking limp and just flops on the floor. Uh, some oh people around start screaming. What? Why? I mean, it was just a punch, dude. Come on, it's not screaming. He I, 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 I oh, there was a, there's a, there was a girl just, walking right there, and she saw you I punch know, by just the fuck out. Of her. Whoa, it's, it's, it's a, it's a rough part of town as well. By the way, the background is still sewer noisy. Oh yeah. Oh, just... Um. So where are you? Yeah, it's where Forest Street, mate. At least if anybody saw me getting chased, I have an excuse to just say he's a crazy dwarf. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, uh, yeah. um, oh, I, I uh, woke up to the next person. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The friendly dwarf walks up. Yeah, 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 because like we have like uh, dwarfs wandering all about town, right? Oh my Sorry. God, I'm, I'm we have really ashamed. Dwarf. I let him around town. Shut, shut the fuck up. We have. <laughs> <What's> uh, <you> <laughs> done? <laughs> we have dwarf. Uh, in uh, um, in in, 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 a short, in a short period of time, a bunch of uh, dwarf collectors come rushing oh, towards uh, this place where someone got knocked the fuck out. <laughs> yeah, and he okay. was like, "Oi, what happened? Did um, he attack you, sir?" Um, I'll explain in dwarfish that um, he did, in fact, attack me. <laughs> Make a love check. Real love. Yeah, what? there's what? an eyewitness, what? so what? you need what? to bluff. <laughs> I, I mean, I even if it wasn't an eyewitness, he would still need to bluff. Yeah. Well, no, fair enough. He did attack me. Come on, he did it. Bluff check. Yeah. Well, bluff. Oh, Come hey, on. that's actually a pretty high bluff check for having such a low skill for it. Alright, one of the guys goes, oh, 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 tell me more. And then the other guy next to him goes, oh, yeah, are you serious? <laughs> that obviously isn't telling the truth. Come on. <laughs> I mean, what? Well, okay, and okay. He goes, what? Oh, especially because he's a black guy. Brian. No, Brian. no, this is not the way. This is not why I signed up for it. Brian, would it help me if I would make up a really good bluff story? <laughs> so, uh, one of them still believes you, and the other one doesn't. What do you do to uh, do that? Uh, to to affect that? Well, I'm glad you asked. Oh, I was yeah. just minding my own business, <coughs> walking around the streets, spitting it out. 
And I'm all saying this in dwarves, by the way, yeah? Mm -hmm. Alright. So he's uh, establishing uh, himself as a troublemaker. Point, uh, at some point, this troublemaker comes up to me. Okay. And um, he comes to me and says, like, Oi, mate. You're a dwarf, aren't you? And I said, like, <laughs> yeah, I'm a dwarf. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what do you want from me, yeah? And he said, like, you know what? I really want to know, like, nil some else. And I said, like, no, 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 mate, you can't do that. I don't like him either. But uh, at this point, the, one of the dwarves uh, looks at the other collected guard and he goes, like, are you serious? You're really going to believe any of it. Come on, all right, I, I'll roll yeah. for another one. Oh, okay. shit. Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Fine, all right, I'll, I'll, I'll play along. I'll play along. Wouldn't someone go by? It's like, oh no, is that isn't that Mr. O'Connell from from the carpenter? Uh, the, the same guard. Uh, the same. The same guard. The guard. same guard goes. Uh, yeah. No, seriously, we we kind of got to uh, book this guy. Come on. And the other goes, hey, come on, let's just hear his story. Could be good. <laughs> All right. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, All right. Fine. Just let. Uh, finish. I'll wait. Then uh, you know. I just got these monocles already, it's fine, I'll just wait. Alright, where was I? I don't know, you you tell us. Ah, oh, fuck, I kind of forgot. I don't say that, actually, but... Buzzock <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> visibly starts sweating. <laughs> Please, mate. The, the, the beard sweat. starts growing with every lie you tell. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm the dwarf Pinocchio now. All right, thank you. <laughs> Dick off. And I said, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he totally came to me. And he said, I want an, I want an SMS. And I told him, nah, you can't do that, man. That's that's proper. That's uh, that's proper. I've done it now. All right, that's enough of this. And one of the guards uh, pours a potion into the unconscious guy. Uh, he waits till he's, uh... No, 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 don't, don't, don't let him wake up. <laughs> <laughs> Too late. I, he's starting I mean, to wake up, Buzz. What do you do? Um, I mean, you probably wake him, or bring him to just a flask of water. You don't need a potion, do you? You know what? I, do, I don't do anything. I, I just turn my ground. Okay. So they uh, revive the guy who wakes up and goes, Oh, uh, uh, oh, what was that? I, I, what I, I, was I, that? I, I'm going for amnesia. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so the guy uh, who wakes up, the uh, uh, the dwarf who wakes up, the guy goes like, Alright, mate, you, you'll be fine. Now, can you tell us what happened? Ah, oh, I, I don't remember. Someone was asking for directions. And he just, he punched me really, really hard. I don't no, remember anything after no, that. No, 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 Alright, no is this the guy that punched you? No, no. <laughs> No, please. Yes. No, no. You're gonna go to jail. I ain't helping you. That's dwarf. Want? That's dwarf racism. <laughs> okay, that's what you say. You don't all look alike, you know. Alright, alright. I'll roll a diplomacy for that. Oh, for fuck fuck's sake. Okay. A diplomacy? That's, that's I, I call that bullshit too, but I'll give you a, a very weak chance. Uh oh. Diplomacy <laughs> is even worse. Holy shit! Wow, I rolled an I, I, okay. I rolled pretty amazingly. I rolled an eight and an eleven. Uh, and the, sa the same guy goes like, "Yeah, man, it's totally dwarf racism." And the other guy yeah. goes, "No, I don't think that's more to the story." Well, I, I think it is though. And um, he goes like, "So, can you tell me which uh, or what dwarf punched you?" And the yeah. guy uh, <laughs> up and he goes like, "Oh yeah, it was totally that guy, man." Like, I mean, I told him what he wanted to know, and I turned away, and he just fucking sucker punched me. <laughs> I, I see. Uh, well, I, I, I think that's, that's all we need. Fuck I it. think I think that's bullshit, though. Uh, and the other guy goes, all right, I'm sorry, it's my job. Just please put your hands back. I mean, I'm sure your innocence will be proven in court. Come on. <laughs> well, I'm going to court? Oh, <laughs> you yeah, I'll let the guy out. Come on, barbarians, come on. 
I, I mean, it's literally just disturbing in peace. I'm sure he, surely he can just be like held till one of us. Yeah, can like pay it off as a misdemeanor. Yeah. No, no I'm sorry. I'm fine. I'm fine. That when no, people no, looking, no, 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 we gotta do this the right way, you know. I'm sure you'll be fine, though. I mean, no dwarf ever gets prosecuted in this city. He whispers. Wow. Oh, uh, corruption. Whoa. Corruption. Wow. Okay, okay. You know what? I shake his hand, and in my hand is a gold coin. I thank you, mate. But you, I still have to manacle you. Yeah, but you know, <laughs> it'll be fine. Don't worry. I won't even lock it. Okay. okay, all right, man. All right, all right, just put your hand. Okay, there we go. And then the other dwarf goes, All right, did you actually lock it? Or did this is the same thing as last time? Oh, <laughs> let me have a look. Let have a look. Oh, no. Oh, see, there we go. You forgot it again. He locks your uh, manacles. <laughs> oh, God. I love how we have good cop, dumb cop. <laughs> So, and uh, they start, uh, they, they start taking you towards this direction. Towards where they, um, you know, where the headquarters is. Am I actually shackled at the moment? Yes, yes yeah. you are. And it is actually <laughs> locked because the other guy checked it. Are they masterwork? Uh, yeah, of course. They're, they're fucking, they're very, very... Okay, pretty. okay, I just wanted to, I just wanted to make sure. <laughs> These are very, very fancy manacles. Oh, like, if anything, the collectors have really good gear. Cool. They need to go at all the people for tax avoidance and shit. Anyway, so, and yes. Can I tell them about what I know? Uh, the rest of you guys... <laughs> yeah. I know. Uh, the rest of you guys uh, arrive at the magic shop. I oh, mean, yeah! Before well, I mean, going uh, to the council meeting? Uh, uh, yes. Well, I mean, we were still in the reception room. We counted up the 2,000 gold pieces, right? All right. Do, I just hold, do I just hold on to that now until we can split it when we get back to the pleasure treasury or what? You can you can do with it what you want, bro. Okay, I guess I'll hold it for the time being. Anyway, um, I, Corso, Cor so Corvus comes into the what's called so Corvus comes into the reception while we're waiting for him. Uh, now we decide tell, where we want to go. I tell them what was the island called again, bro? The Isles of. Sorry. Uh, what were the islands called again? The broken islands. Oh, the, I, the broken I, I, I like isles. It. Broken Isles, sorry. The Broken Isles. Oh, I tell them we need to go to the Broken Isles because Martian might be there. Uh, also, I need to take a piss again, so... Is that oh, that Jesus. evil druid guy? Oh. Hmm? Jesus. Oh, motherfucker, I'm in court. You in jail? Oh, uh, uh. There's a difference. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Thanks for pointing that out, you asshole. For the record, you have no chance in hell of breaking those manacles. Nah, I don't care about that. I'm I'm just gonna get like fucked up because like dwarf rule kinda rule this town. Well yeah. I tell the party that uh Smashan might have been the guy who killed the dragon turtle and they are in uh the broken isle. What what did you say his name was? Smashan. 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 Yep. Smashan. Uh, good. Yeah, well. I, I, I make a remark about orcs being a simple people, and sometimes I I envy people being that simple. You remember the story of an uh, of a orc, a half orc named Wog. Ah, uh, God. I also Wog. remember the story. I also remember the story of half elf brothers Lurtz and Gertz. Oh, uh, God. That was did, did, uh, someone, did someone say walk? Walk. Yeah. Like Warhammer 40k, work, walk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's what I immediately thought of. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah, we had a little side adventure because Arson right. keeps like leaving. Alright. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, where were we, guys? We're going we're to the magic place. We're about to head to the magic shop. Very well. You all head towards the. the... Caravan? The rare, the rare, the rare caravan. Yeah, the rare caravan. Yeah. yeah. There we go. Rare caravan. All right. So. Guys I got there. Uh, yeah, okay. Papa was like, hi, boss. Uh, the the shop is open, of course. Yeah. I go there's in. A, there's a little boss like a... camp running around, of course. Yeah. Yeah. 
And I you... asked the lady. Uh, go ahead. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. You were all greeted by uh, the proprietor of the shop. Mm-hmm. I, I, I heard the shop broke. Ah, uh, shit. If you free items, if you win a game of, uh, was it me, guys? Yeah. I'm looking for the. Yeah. I'm looking for my. Uh, can you send it to me again, uh, Darky Dark? Oh, also, oh, okay. Yeah, 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 give me a moment. Yeah, um, mm, 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 mm. yeah cause I did say I would work for the 8,000 gold, but we never actually signed like a contract of employment, so we need to do that soon. Indeed, indeed we didn't. Yeah, so, well, I mean, can I, well, can I get you back to I you in the evening? I think you don't have to worry about that, dear. I think I'll just contact you whenever I need your help. It doesn't matter where you are, I can advise right. you. I, I, I just... I point out that's rather suspicious, ma'am. I take out the, the like the phone stone from my bag and it's like, yeah, okay, okay, can I add you your number on this? <laughs> <laughs> you, you know the phone stone I got from the academy. From the academy, I was like, can yes. you inscribe your like runes oh, on the right side? Don't you yeah. worry about that, sweetheart. I just know where to find. I ask her if I could roll. Like, I tell her, I heard that your shop gives free items if you win a game of Snake Eyes. Make a bluff check right away. I oh, say shit. don't... I say it's, it's more... It's more than you bargain for, really. Don't, just don't do it. John, do it. he's the one who won before, remember? Oh, yeah. He's just trying right. to bluff and get more items. And he looks oh. different now, so... Oh, yeah, that's true. That's fun. Wow, I mean... I don't know what happened to you, my dear Corvus. <laughs> oh shit! Oh, 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 oh. I do believe I that you, uh, you got one before, didn't you? Shit! Uh, <laughs> I was just say, hey, try. <laughs> Actually, uh, why don't you stay for a bit after the rest left? <laughs> oh, 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 fuck it. Oh, okay. Wow, 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 wow. Where is this going? <laughs> I, I just said. Uh, Why? Because you're an elf now. Why do you think? <laughs> There's something I'd like to discuss with you, but I know. It doesn't have to do with that dagger you got. Well, I take I take out my phone soon. I'm like, okay, I'll, I'll I'll see you guys in a bit. I'm just gonna take out and make a call. Anyway, and right. I go I, I step I step outside and then I put the phone soon up to my ear and I call my whistle. I call the dean at the Arkin. <laughs> Hello, who's this? Yeah. Oh, it's Dar. I, I found a book that you might be interested in earlier. Did you? Hello. Yeah, Did anyone there? For for the love of sh stop shouting. I can hear you fine. <laughs> I'm sorry! I'm not sure how to work the volume! You... you made these. How do you not know? <laughs> I didn't make these! Didn't you? Who, di who did? These ancient things! I just ah. don't know how to work them! Right, well... <coughs> I'll be coming by later today after I'm done with uh, this uh, kerfuffle with the council meeting and I'll show you what, what I found. <laughs> I, 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 I like put the like I, I put the phone down, I like massage my temples and pick the phone back up. <laughs> hello. Okay. Hello. Hello. I, I'm bringing by a book that has a ritual for summoning blood hawks, and I think you might be interested in that. Hello. Hello. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. Okay. <laughs> I have a book for summoning blood hogs. Blood hogs? Yes. Nasty creature, that? Yeah. What about I thought it might, I thought it might be a good addition to the library. Blood hogs to Wait. the library? No, no the book. A, a book. It's a book. Book? Wouldn't I have yes. needed a book about? It's a, it's a book about blood hogs. Oh. <laughs> okay. Who's this? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. It's the new student. Dara! How's it going? <laughs> uh, it's going fine. Uh, boss keeps cutting off the beard. The monocle hasn't gotten any worse. So that's the thing. Huh. He, seems to be, he seems to be fine when it comes to seeing. So. Is that what his beard? Actually, that's the point. Can, 
Can you send some more medicine, but this time put some sleep stuff in it? Which is, is there <laughs> stuff that we can use to make him less aggressive? Fuck off! <laughs> <laughs> yes, I suppose, but it's, I don't know. That's uh, kind of a great area. Yeah, I, I'm not. I'm not telling. I'm not telling you to lace his next set of medicine with sedatives, but it might be helpful to just to like the general public if you do. All right. Uh, no. <laughs> well, uh, next time you're in the tower, I'll, uh, I'll give you some. Yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Ciao. All right. Who is this again? Oh, fuck's sake. I'll see you in a bit. I pressed the button. All right. Tink. Put the phone no. back in my bag. Bro, well, wouldn't I need to roll a disguise? I mean, yeah. I mean, she's already seen. What do you mean, her. roll disguise? Are you going to disguise something while an elf? I'm an elf now. <coughs> well, then you're no, you not wearing a disguise. You are just okay. an entirely separate person. Okay. No. Yeah. Either way, so you guys do what you need to do in the magic shop. Okay. Yes. I guess I'm staying yeah, here. is asked to uh, do something for the magic shop owner. I, I wonder right, why okay. Wolfram hasn't been contacted to do this since he's actually indentured to her. I think it rhymes with Rex. Uh, she goes oh, like, no. so it's come to my attention that you've actually got into contact with um, Javiado. Maybe. Who's asking? Wait. Why? Uh, I mean, it's not really a secret. I don't me know or... I don't about that, but... No, she's asking the people in the shop right now, or telling I'm, the people. I'm, I'm standing outside. Uh, yeah, just the ones that are inside the shop. Then I'm in the shop. Yeah. I probably got to the shop before anybody. Maynard, Irisu, May, uh, Bullet, or sorry, Corvus, <laughs> uh, Irisu, Wolfram. Well, you see, he and I go way back, and um, oh. last I knew. He, uh, he kind of disappeared. Wait, what was your name? Uh, it's a good question. <laughs> I gave you that. <laughs> I, know, I, know, I know, I think I, I, I only opened one, sorry. Okay. My name is Seareth. Let's see. You wouldn't happen to have changed your name at some point, would you? <laughs> no, I've always been known as Sira. And you notice that she's a beautiful, slender woman with long, scarlet red hair. Oh, okay. Probably not. That looks pretty neatly tied up. Fair enough. Her eyes are hazel brown. Ooh. <laughs> Interesting. Kind of hey. Yeah, just so you know. She looks about, she looks about 30. Interesting. Sorry, we're looking for the people and we're basically trying to follow any leads we can to finding his old companions. Oh, you're we, not we, have, we think our donkey is one of them. So. Oh shit, where is my donkey? Good question. Uh, your donkey is outside one of the sewer grates. Oh, and by the way, um, I want to rename my donkey, if that's possible, to uh, Donkey Shop. Donkey, <laughs> whatever you want. Until it turns oh, into Donkey Hote. Yeah. Donkey well, Hote. I don't care about your opinion. His name is now Donkey Shop. Donkey. Yeah, our donkey, uh, our friend's donkey thinks it's uh, Mao <coughs> yeah. I don't care about his opinion. I think the next donkey I guess in D and I'm just gonna call it Hote. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Hey, it's Donkey. It's the next. Actually, uh, Wolver probably right. I don't know. Yeah, he is actually. All right, because I actually like read that book. It's it's really funny. Yeah. It's a really funny book. Either way, uh, also I read it in old English, which is a fucking pain to get through, but it's still <laughs> Back to Actually, the game. Actually, that's suspect as fuck. You said she looks like she's in her what thirties. Uh, yet yeah. she somehow goes way back with Ariador, who's been out of commission for long enough for everybody else to have he had known to be lost to obscurity. That's suspicious as fuck. <laughs> I guess. I mean, yeah, she's a suspicious one. She runs a magic shop full of cursed items. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, wow, good job her, figuring her it age, out. 
Yeah, like her age is probably the least of our worries. To be honest. Bro, you put the hey, I'm not the one that's an indentured sex servant. So. All right, all right. So what? Uh, what else do you want to know while you guys are there? Uh, I asked what her uh, involvement with Ariador was. Well, like I said, we go way back. I do not bother. Uh, how how you old are you? Oh, you don't ask a lady how old. Yeah. Are you? I, man, I, I, I do it all the time. Fuck it. Thirty something. Thirty something. Uh, I, I do point out that Ariador is literally like centuries or something old since oh, he yes. was gone. So that's for her to have known Ariador in such a short span is extremely suspect. Uh, make, uh, I want you guys to make a spot check. Uh, well, yeah, not me though. Uh, no, the ones that are in the shop, of course. Yeah. Oh, hey, my spot's actually really high. Yeah. Ah oh, shit. Uh, hey, I'm, just, I'm just playing with hey. Finley. Oh, like, nice. You're also outside. So. Yeah, as I said, I'm playing playing with Finley outside, waiting for you guys to finish. Well, okay. she does look magical enough to um, have, or to be an acquaintance of Ariadne. I don't know. There's some there's some sort of serenity enveloping her aura, or the way you look at her that that seems like yeah, that's pretty possible. It doesn't seem evil, though. No, oh, no. Oh, okay. Just that Only Jesus. we had a paladin. <laughs> Man, I'll quit it. We heard you the first time. <laughs> <laughs> yes. How can I help you, Mr. Steele? I mean, like the question is really, how can you help me? But sure, I'll entertain you. I uh, pull Lita to the side real quick and just whisper, she seems to know Ariador, and we're still wondering how that even works. We're assuming yeah. magic. Everyone knows Ariador. Uh, since she overheard me, I'm like, yes, but it knows Ariador personally. Huh. Uh, apparently... So you think Ariador has party members, do you? We are completely sure he does. Approximately four. Know. That's very interesting. How did you come to learn of this? I'm extremely suspect right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, I'm not sure how much we should tell her. <laughs> you know why so do you ask? You should have had a dwarf variant with you. Yeah, man, it's uh, like to jump like that. Uh... Actually, uh, can I ask for a piece of paper and a pen real quick? No. Why we from her? From anybody. Aren't you blind? You have all my papers, Maynard. The only thing you need is a pen. Oh, then I ask for a pen. There's a book or a pen or a, a quill, a pen or uh, ink and quill, really, at our on our desk. Like, please, if you want to write it down, it's fine. You can use this. Uh, the, the uh, first yeah. thing I do is, uh... Wolfram, roll sense motive. Ooh! Can I roll as well? Of course, anyone who wants to... <laughs> I'm uh, like, plus seven. There doesn't seem to be anything wrong with uh, what she's Wait. saying. Oh! And Lidith, you as well believe there's something wrong with what she's saying. Oh. There's something or nothing? Uh, wait, hold on. I believe someone asked what the relation exactly was. What, are, what way that did you mean the legendary paladin? Yeah. Alright, she goes, um, well, you must know. We did date. <laughs> they, uh, okay, that's <sighs> interesting. Is that why you're immortal because of his magical semen? Oh, don't be silly. That was <laughs> what? <laughs> He's a paladin, not a fucking necromancer. <laughs> what the hell was that? Necromancer, <laughs> rapist. No. <laughs> I, think, I, think, <laughs> I think personally it was a legit question. <laughs> oh, Jesus. 
That was awesome. Either way, uh, the frame. So we'll see, this is, this is why I'm waiting outside. You guys are retarded. Wolver, we'll make a spot check. <laughs> Yeah, Wolfram, make a spot check. You spot the necromancer, Jez. Well, you, what you do spot is that the child looks nothing like her at all. Ooh. Well, we can have a same. We have a little Joffrey. Um, if you, when you ask her what she is exactly, Lilith, she goes like, <laughs> I do oh, yeah, just that you guys can figure that out yourselves at some point. Besides, I'm just a magic shop owner for now. Ma'am, when you're saying you personally know a centuries, like, old person that just recently got revived and that most people don't know about, like, at all? No, no, no. no. Everyone knows about Ariador. No, I mean no that... One, no one knows the rest. No one, I you mean, like, he means, like, personally. Yeah. Oh, yeah, personally. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> I, I'm just saying we do have reason to be sus. Oh, he has no reason to be suspect. <laughs> I just know the guy. What else? I, do you know? Let me put this into perspective. We have been going around the entire continent, I suppose, mm -hmm. killing cultists in every city we found. Really? So... What's it with those? <laughs> also, Dara Bars is in the actually bar. seems very The word is like, suspicious. She shifts from being um, like evasive and coy to. Being, don't tell him. Like, really interested in hearing about don't cultists. Tell him, don't tell him, don't tell him. Well, to be fair, if if I do tell her and she is involved with them, I'm not telling her anything new. She would know that crap already if she was involved with them. You'll be the end of us all. That's why I'm <laughs> avoiding talking directly about fucking Ariador. Wolfram still takes out the missive from Ariador. Oh god damn what it. Oh for fuck's sake. <laughs> Okay. Uh, do you have it to her? I mean, you only took it out, so... Fair enough. By the way, bro, the uh, token isn't where we are. No, I know. Sorry. The token is we should just right stop there, whipping right it out, just willy-nilly. Anyway, <laughs> uh, while he's doing that and looking at the note for some reason, I... <coughs> well, to be fair, she could just bluff that she knows his handwriting. Like... That's not hard. But anyway, I, I go on to explain that there have been cultists doing strange rituals in just about every town we've been to. The question is, do you give the missive to uh, to her or not? Or you take it out, or do you give it to her? Do not do it. Do not do it. Do it. No. Oh, you fucking asshole. Pretty much asking Maynard to mm -hmm. say yes or no. Yeah. What I did the missive say again? Uh, the something missive about said to companion. look for his old party members because there is indeed great evil afoot. It's but just... it doesn't go into specifics. Uh, it tells the names of the ones that you found oh, as Maynard, as a, you know, as a statue. Fair enough. <clears throat> you know that the missive is definitely from Ariador because he names the names that you were sent to look for and you found those names before. Hey, Brian? Mm hmm. I, I kind of want to get out of jail. <laughs> <laughs> I know you can do it. I know you do, bro. Oh, that was so, so oh. cute. <laughs> I know you do. Oh. Don't worry. Uh, it's going to be a great session. Yes. Not just not just just not this one. <laughs> yeah, but be fair. Um, information I... is power, Wolfram. Especially I'm information be fair, with bro. On it. You assaulted someone on the streets. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, 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 don't, I don't mean it like that. Well, um, uh, is there a chance for me to get out of jail or have no. any? Right now, there is no chance. Right now, there is no chance. Right now, we are with other people. Have, have any interest? Uh, this, this is this is pretty much going on at the same time as you're being arrested. So, yeah. Hold but... on. Okay. How about this? We show her the note, but don't mention mm -hmm. fucking anything else we've found about Ariador's party, including the fact that our donkey seems to think he's a monk. Okay. So you do show the missive from Ariador to her. Yeah. <clears throat> Like, there's very little harm in showing just the names of the people. 
because okay. they were at some point legends to begin with. Okay. So, yeah. <clears throat> okay. Uh, she um, she goes like. Sing. And um, uh, she heads you back to missive. So, you guys are indeed the ones who got him back to this plane, aren't you? I find it strange that you know that, but yes. Interesting. Again, I'm very sorry about being so suspicious but we we have good call to be of course i can't imagine the strife you guys have went through to get to this point uh awesome. we point at corvus well he got punched by a blood lurker or blood hulk outside oh, wait I'm just, hulk. outside i'm just like holding yeah. finley by the front paws and just dancing him around <laughs> <laughs> By the way, what happened to uh, Shiznat? Oh, uh, Shiznat uh, threw away at some point, and he hasn't uh, come back yet. <laughs> e either way, uh, yeah. So fine. he he got turned into a fine miss in one hit. So suffice See. it to say, we've had trouble. <laughs> huh? Amazing. Right. But that the fact that his soul came back and got reincarnated it tells something no oh oh no 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 that was just Lydith over there she she's a druid she can do that yes but from what i understand from reincarnation is that the soul wants to come back well nobody wants to be dead usually so uh, the reason... you uh okay yes i suppose so <laughs> yeah fucking shit elves <laughs> <laughs> see so what else um, can I do for you? Because obviously I know Ariadne. Obviously. Uh, I said sarcastically. Well, we have this one friend in jail. That we don't even know. <laughs> we don't is. know that. I know you don't. To... <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> I, I'm just like, well, I suppose for the moment being, just knowing that you know Ariadne. We, we can work on that later. We're... Just don't be confused about that. For now, I'm... can we just pretend that hasn't happened and go on as usual with the shopping and the Well, I mean, Arian has nothing to do with my shop, of course. That's perfect, then. And she still doesn't have any further tokens, the bitch. However, now that I know that you guys are associated with that, I do believe that uh, two of you, uh, of your party members, are indeed indebted to me. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, what? Uh, two of you people are uh, indeed indebted to me. I believe Wolfram and Dara outside, who's playing with a spare. It looks like. I I just look out the door to see him doing that. Yeah. <laughs> Very well. Well, I will have some some source of activity for them ready for when I need them. For now, they are free to do what they want. Okay. Considering you run such a fabulous magic shop, I'm sure you can get them back here whenever. Oh, don't back. worry. I can get to them whenever I want. <laughs> yeah, you saying that doesn't make us trust you. Yeah, boy. Can you, can you? Can you? Don't need to trust why? me. Just know that you can fear me. Mm. Oh, I do. Mm. That's good. Those magic items. You Maybe. are one of the wisest one, it seems. Oh. Yeah. Uh. I'm getting kind of turned on here. <laughs> You're in jail. You're not allowed to be turned on. Uh, yes, but <laughs> you are in fact now escorted to uh, a jail cell underneath. Uh, what? For, uh, what are we you are underneath uh, this area right now. Oh, that's kind of that's kind of where I needed to go, actually. Uh, that's where you wanted to be, maybe. But you are now in a cell and not on the outside of a cell. Either way, um, does anyone want to ask anything else to this lady, or ask this lady before we continue on? You've uh, not sorry, got a shipment of feathers, have you? 
So what do you have that reduces one's own weight? I, I'm, I'm sorry. I do not have anything that reduces weight. Uh, perhaps this bag will uh, suffice? Do you mean a bag of holding? I believe she already has one. I, I think she meant like to reduce her weight so she could move fast. I could be wrong about that, though. It is indeed called a bag of holding, if you like. What happens when you stick a bag of holding into another bag of holding? Inception. Guys, you will hear a very like <laughs> black hole, <laughs> and then all of a sudden you're watching Inception. Mm. Logistically speaking, though, I imagine it would work the same as putting a portable hole I mean, in a bag of holding, in which it would explode. Yeah. Oh yes, there is a serial killer going about out here. I'm afraid I do not know more than except for that they're using the tours to get around. Isn't that correct? Uh, yeah. Oh, we yes. also how? <laughs> you know, I, I just fucking go with it. I'm like, whatever. How you ask? She are looks you gonna like answer you me straight? Almost taunting. <laughs> I'm, I'm just like, are you gonna actually answer straight? Have you no, talked? not really. I'm yeah. just going to say, I know some things. Okay, then I, I'll just retract the question then. I think it's very clear that I am not the culprit. Yeah, well, I, 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 I never suspected you on that part. Mm. Well, good. Um, I do have a few potions that give you more strength, but they are always... Very temporary. Here uh, also, body. I am not an armorer. I'm sorry. Uh, I, I suppose now that I've had my fucking report, uh, <laughs> I, I just ask if she has a spell book, a spell component pouch, and a pearl of power, like the lowest level of them. I do have an empty spell book you could use. It's not cursed, is it? Of course it's cursed. Have you heard how this lady talks? It sounds like a female Brian. It. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, I just lost it. Oh. <laughs> Either way, uh. Yeah, uh, the spell book at least she has, you said. Yes. Uh, but not the components pouch or the. Uh, she does have a component pouch, sorry, yes. Oh, okay. But the Pearl of Power is a no. Mm-mm. Okay, I'll I'll just take those for now then. Hey right, Brian, slider to gold. Yes. Um. Or however much she asks for you it. Have, uh, any more need for me tonight? Uh, the the uh, actually we're going we're to probably going to end. Yeah. Uh, we're probably going to start next session with you uh, in jail, boys. No, no, no. You know what? We'll start it now. No, no he's well, saying we're going to end soon. We're going to no, end soon. Uh-huh. Yes. So if you if you want to go, that's that's totally cool, bus. But bus. No, I don't want to go. I want to fucking break out. <laughs> yeah, that's honestly. We're probably not going to get to you right away unless someone else is going to look for you and find you. Uh, yeah. how, how much would the uh, book and uh, components pouch cost? Rather, how much um, does she want for them? Like nothing. She'll sell it for a uh, hundred gold. Hundred gold. They're like 20 gold. That's like five times the price. Jesus Christ. Yeah, she's selling it for 100. Oh, fuck it. Whatever. I'll, okay, I'll just I'll just roll with it because okay. she's obviously way more powerful than I am at this point. So. That's fine. That doesn't mean you can't uh, try and bargain, but... Yeah, I got people bargains. They got cursed items. <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. I understand. I am... She said I was wise. I'd prefer paranoid. She looks at you, Manestina, and she goes, Wow, it certainly looks like you've been kidnapped out quite well already. Yeah, but is it alright for me to fuck off? Actually, was her bow cursed? Does it do anything? Has it been doing anything? No. Um, depends, Lilith. <laughs> How many hours have you shot since then? Yeah, fuck all. Hey, anyway, can I fuck off now? 
None from that bug, okay? And then, uh, yeah, no idea. Yeah. It doesn't look cursed at all. Yeah, Tom, we're gonna start with you on the next uh, session. Uh, yeah, right. Then, uh, uh, no. I'll take my leave, yeah? All right, oh, yeah, take sure, care, man. No problem. Hey, Thanks hey, for hey, joining. Have a wonderful session. Bye, Tom's mom! Bye, mom! Bye, Tom's mom, but I'm not stopping the recording yet. <laughs> oh, no, Bye, no, no. mom. Just bye, Tom. <laughs> Pretty nice. Yeah, so. you know what? You eat a dick, you asshole. Oh, my yeah. God. I haven't done anything. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm a little friendly. Anyway, so yeah. I'm fuzzy. What do you guys want to try while you're at the magic shop? I live inside a bard's hat. <laughs> what? <laughs> I, I'm singing little songs while I'm playing with Finley. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, and and uh, Finley's like, dude, stop. <laughs> I'm like, no. Uh, Wolverm, you want to buy a one of your eye wounds? Yes, she does have. Uh, she does have stock of. <laughs> Let me look it up real quick. Uh, for a thousand gold pieces, she, she's willing to send uh, to sell you a one of your light wounds. Okay. Uh, she does not have magical helmet, fortunately. No heads either. Oh yeah, can I find like a general store in this area that just sells like ink, quills, and yeah, paper? Yeah, and shit? for sure. Well, then I go do that. All right? Yeah, you just find a store with uh, normal prices for ink, uh, all that stuff. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I am afraid I do not have any magical weapons left either. Ah, you guys are pretty much probably blind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually, there is still a porm left. Do you want a porm? A really nice porm? I think I'm the only one who can even effectively use a pole arm. Oh, I think David is a... Yeah, pole arm. <laughs> anyway, I buy an ink pen and some ink and, like, five sheets of paper. Well, but it's making it even ten. It's very nice pole arm. It definitely does damage to whatever it hits. You want it? Remember, I gave you nine pieces. Yeah, but I'm just gathering more for myself. Yeah. You never know when you're going to need paper after. And as a newly minted wizard, I'm probably going to need a lot. As you read the, the description of the pole arm that she points out, uh, Manasina, uh, you read that it's called Penance, Ravager of Cruelty. <laughs> what a good name. Uh, it's said that it's it was once owned by an ice giant king, Mauron. It also costs ten thousand gold pieces. Can I ask her who my dagger used to belong to? I won't. Out of curiosity. <laughs> they probably couldn't figure it out because the body was shriveled up. <laughs> Um, your, your dagger was indeed found on some corpse and they have no idea. Uh oh. Yeah.
I'm afraid you already played the game, so... Wait, did you actually? Did you get any magic item from it? Yeah. Oh, you can play. Who's snoring? Well, I would like to say that uh, since you are quite new here, I would allow you to roll for this item. If you uh, roll higher than I do, you will get to keep the item free of charge. Um, if you don't make it and I win, then you will owe me the amount of gold, either in gold or man hours. Or man hours. Oh, uh, fun, fun, fun. Are you That's snoring, good. Dara? And who is snoring? Yes. It's David. No, David is even here. <laughs> no, it's Dara. Oh, it's John. Yeah. Huh. Give me a break. <laughs> <laughs> Stay, with us, like, Stay with us. Stay with us. Uh, if uh, you like, you can okay. try and roll for this poor orb. If That's you win, was... you will get the full arm for free. If you lose, you will either have to pay it in gold or you have to work off your debt. What do you want to do? Just tell me if he wins or he loses. It's a she. Oh, no. Tell me if... Tell me what's the results. Tell me if it's a win first. If, the, if it's a win, I'll alter fortune. <laughs> what an asshole. <laughs> I mean, if it's a win for her, I'll go to fortune. Give you higher chances. Or item win. that's being sold for. Her. No, no, it's, it's, it's pretty okay, actually. So far, most of them have won. Except me. Yeah, except, and except you and Wolfram, yeah. Also, give me a break. I was out clubbing until like 2 in the morning, came back, had to get my flights around like, had to leave the house at 4. Uh huh. Get out to get on the plane. Well, leave the house by four, stay in the airport for two hours. The flight was delayed a bit. Then got to the airport around seven. First train back wasn't until 8 40, so I was a pain in the ass. So I had to go get breakfast from somewhere. I got a decent breakfast at Frankie and Benny's. I was alright. Then I came home, couldn't sleep for a bit, <coughs> then just dozed off for ages. God. And now I'm just like drifting in all sleep. And lectures oh. and things start tomorrow, and I don't want to. <laughs> I have to do company law tomorrow. Uh... That's so good, bro. It's so good. Company law. It's alright. Anyway, man, I've seen it. Come on. Uh... What did you do? I think it's happy. Aww, oh, pussy. Yeah, sure, certainly. It's right across from here. Uh, just a few minutes' walk. To give you the directions. <laughs> yeah, fuck! <laughs> Alright, does anyone else want to do anything uh, very specific right now? I just or should we, uh, shall we call it uh, a session for today? Oh, I think we should call it a session. I'm just I know gonna you to call in a session, John. I wasn't. <laughs> clearly. <laughs> no. It is the same day as the council meeting, and uh, I think most of you guys are wanting to call it a uh, stop for tonight. Yep, let's do it. All right. I think we're uh, almost near three hours of recording anyway, so it's yes. be a good time to stop anyway. Just about Amazing. Uh, All right. Goodbye, Tom's Bye, mom. Bye, Tom's mom. Goodbye, Bye. Uh, Bye. Uh, <laughs> uh, bonjour. Je m'appelle Tom. You might know me from my episodes Animated Reviews with Tom, with such animals as the seahorse, the turtle, and of course, the panda bear. Uh, for my next episode, we're gonna do something different. 
a different hall, you ask me? Uh, oui, oui, glad you ask. Um, I'm gonna do an, a reptile today, namely the alligator. You might know them as flat dinosaurs, but no, no, they're not flat dinosaurs. They're actually related to the dinosaurs and also to the snake, but they're not a snake and they're not a dinosaur. Uh, the alligator lives uh, widely across the world. You have a couple of different ones, but they are in America. Uh, they are in uh, Africa and they are also in Asia. We, oui. all across the world. Uh, when an alligator is in the water, he feels at his best. Because not many people know that alligators can indeed swim. And when they swim, they often are mistaken for a log. A log as in a tree, wee oui, wee. Oui. Yes, yes. And uh, they also like to hunt in the water. Well, 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 look at me. I'm a little antelope. I'm just thirsty for a drink. No. Huh? But what's that? It is water. Ah, water. I will use that to quench my thirst. Thinks the little antelope. But little does the little antelope know that there is also an alligator in the sea water. So, hmm, thinks the little antelope. Hmm, oh, that is good water, thinks the little antelope. And it can, keeps on continuing to drink a little more. Hmm, such good water. But meanwhile, oh, what is that? I think it's something in the sea water. No, oh, is it coming closer? Is it coming closer ever again? It is! It is coming closer! But guess what the little antelope thinks? The little antelope thinks nothing. Still the water is good. But... Oh! Dun dun! Dun dun! Dun 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 dun! Oh yes! The elegant strikes! Oh! Such rich... Such ferocity, oh! <laughs> yes, 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 the little antelope by its neck. And then he does his party move by rolling over and over in the water, breaking the little antelope's neck until it dies because of his neck is no more. No, the neck is no more. Ah, oui, I hear you think. But uh, yes, the alligator has a very, very nice snack. Hmm. An antelope for dinner, huh? Mm hmm. Bien sûr. Très bien. Alright. This was episode 6 of Tom's Anime Review of Animal Reviews. I love you. Mwah. And bonsoir.